All right. Welcome to the finals. RV versus 5PM. RV chooses Team A in the map select. We're gonna start map select shortly. Mandy, do you think we're gonna get a fracture game today? For the first time ever? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, okay. Have either of these teams tried to get I mean, fracture yet? I think fracture was supposed to be not. I don't think these two. I think these teams have gotten it out of the, the pool, but they usually band it late in the pool. So maybe if someone's feeling really spicy, they they drop in a an early pick on it. Who knows? <laughs> Unlikely, but there's a chance. All right. RB with the first map ban. What do you think they'll ban, Mandy? Last night, as the A pick, Pearl. they banned Haven as their first ban. Um, in really? their quarterfinal round, they didn't ban Haven because the other team banned Haven, but they banned Bind for second ban. So, you think history will repeat itself? We get Icebox here. Okay. They saw they saw Jeff Shaw's Viper on Icebox, and they're like, fuck mm -hmm, no. Mm -hmm. We will pass. They saw the struggle. Gunner, can you tell us all about the struggle? Is he here? Hello? Uh-oh. Can you tell us about the Icebox oh, yeah. struggle as attackers? Yeah, RB uh, Oh no, as defenders. Yeah. <laughs> RB playing Icebox against 5pm. You know, how was it playing against 5pm and Icebox? Um, you know, they actually- they, they- Honestly, they just- They were really good. Like, they would- find the site that had the least amount of people, and then they would just suddenly attack it. They would go back and forth until they found the correct spot. It was very difficult. Alright, well, Haven now off the board. RB doesn't have to burn a ban on Haven if 5pm is going to do it for them, so... First map pick goes to RB. Thoughts on their map pick? It looks like, you know, they have preferred to play... Oh, they picked Breeze earlier, but... And it's or Breeze twice, so they're going to pick Breeze again. They love Breeze, they have the aimers, they have the aggression to play on Breeze. Pretty scary. Alright. They pick... Uh, map bands are just flying in Pearl on the side of 5pm. They've been picking Pearl consistently as well. Breeze, Pearl, I think these are maps that can they have pretty long angles. Even though both teams seem to be fine with them, and I think Breeze, even though RB favors Breeze so much, um, EZJS is a mean Viper player, and Breeze is really good on both, or Viper is really good on both Breeze and Pearl. Look at Mandy trying to push together the pick bands. I respect it. Thanks, Mandy. I think it's easier than alt tabbing. Yeah. Mandy's and when I alt tab, my Valorant minimizes. So. Yeah. Manny's just like, look, we're gonna we're gonna stay on schedule. So breeze. Pearl. We're already behind schedule. We didn't start till ten oh, seven oh one. Oh my god. Fracture gone. No fracture this entire tournament, so it seems. And then the final map ban is going to be <clears throat> between what? Bind and Ascent. Where are we going for map 3? If a map 3 happens, hopefully it does. Man, look how even the pings are between two teams too. This is going to be a fair game, I guess. Bind. So Ascent is the last map remaining. And then RB will choose the side for Ascent. Damn, Mandy, you type fucking fast. Are you a god? Thanks. What's your, what's your words per minute? Man? I'm like 106. Oh my god. I only type with two fingers primarily, too. What? What the heck? Mm -hmm. 
Teddy, what's your words per minute? It's around there, yeah. Like, I use my pinky for, like, control and shift and thumb for space, but all of the letters... Yours is around there, too, I remember. Alright. Wasn't it? Freeze. <clears throat> Freeze up first, friends. Are you guys ready? Man, are you ready? Spectators ready? Everybody's ready? Let's go. Hop straight into Breeze. RB ready. And okay, now once 5 p.m. gives the go ahead, we'll hop straight into the first map. It's gonna be RB's map pick. They've looked really dominant in this map considering how strong of a namer Jay Chung is and how good of a entry fragger Captain Ouija is. Three, two, one. Teddy, can we get a skid it? Let's get it. Also, the stream <laughs> title says Season 4 Day 4. What? Ham versus 5 p.m. Stream, wrong name. Oh. Oh, shit. Wait, is Dan here? Can he help me rename the stream real quick? Dan isn't here unless he's watching. I don't know how to do this, Elena. Hold on. How do I do- how do I rename the stream when I'm not in the stream? Alright, well, Brian's do, figuring out his ship. The when I'm not in the okay. Game. Sword Looks like we have a Viper on both sides, a Sova both sides, Chamber both sides. We're gonna have Emmy on Reyna, which we oh, know she is boss it. on. Link on Phoenix. Captain Meiji locks in on Euro, and Insight locks in on KO. Oh, Alright, I have changed the stream title. We're in it. We're seeing very minimal smokes except for Vipers. Can someone check to make sure that I actually changed the stream title? Maybe you have to refresh it. Yeah, we're good to go. Flashes on both sides. So... Emmy and Insight both have flashes. So does Iru, so... Give me, give me your players to watch. Teddy, give me your players to watch. You just played against 5pm. I mean, Choose your the agent. obvious answer. Someone I know who I'm watching. Yeah, I mean, Emmy has been on a roll. See if she can bring it into finals. But honestly, no matter how well or badly she does, I mean, hopefully she pops off. All right, Jeff Shaw is a rock and will always be a rock. I think this team is just gonna be really dangerous. They're, they'll always be competitive, but if they're ticking, if Mayan's feeling it, if Emmy's feeling it, they got to finals for a reason, so. How are you feeling about only having Viper smokes on both teams here? On this map where smokes are like really essential. I think it's pretty fine actually because Viper can cut sites in half in this map so effectively. Especially like on the A site where you can just cut off the back side of the site and just you know, have a free shot to close pyramid. Elena's blending. Right, all right. Hop wars on a breeze map. Do you think 5 p.m. is going to be lacking anything with EasyJS not playing Phoenix and like being that aggressor? I, I think it worked out last time for them on Icebox. Link was the one playing the Phoenix, and EasyJS is on the Viper, and he's so good at being sneaky on the Viper getting behind people and making their lives miserable and I just slowing down pace in general and I think RB is a really pacey team I think if they can make if high PM can make RB play their tempo their speed on this map I think they have a good shot at taking away RB's map pick all right it's gonna be Sopa with the dart out in mid Ooh, Ooh, gets shot in the face but he's not dead just yet and man here on the A site, sees the drone come out. The tag misses, but Jay Chung swings the pistol. Gets so look a little confused after that bullet hit him in the head. Man, Must have knocked him out. Duel, but he goes down pretty quickly. Emmy goes down two after taking down one. JS coming from mid. He's gonna have his work cut out for him though in a two v four. Uh, that's a team kill on the sofa. That's a little unfortunate because it makes this round kind of hard. Jay really hurt. Last player Hobby gets standing. dinked, but it's not enough, and now it's a link. Only 7 HP to his name, though. Oh. No util to heal himself either, so. He might get a free kill on Jay Chung if he can get the shot. He sees the shoulder! Jay Chung sees his shoulder, too. First round over to right, buddies. 
That round was really difficult for me, and he was stuck on site alone. Tried to kill the dar uh, kill the drone, then teleported out of the back site, but right into the front site, and they just swarmed him from mid and from uh, A main. Honestly, an impossible round for me, and, and the smoke wall cut off the help from his teammates too, made it really difficult for them to ever really get a foothold in this round. And so I mean, got dinked at the very start of the round. Charlie too. Mike, let's move. If it gets pinged out, he's silenced and can't teleport away, so it's just gonna be him sitting here with a shotgun. Oh, gonna get this hidey hole exposed. He's gonna teleport back side now. Emmy. The whole site pretty much gonna make it. The whole team gonna make it on site. Yeah, it's gonna be pretty free to find site. But they are waiting for their flankers before they try to push in. Luigi waiting for that wall to go down. Nice headshot on Link. Yeah. Trying to swing from orange. Use the KO, but can't finish it. Kill with nice shots on the Yoru. A double dink from distance. She makes it possible. So for a time with the close gets the, kill. the Viper into 2v2 with the thrifty. It's gonna be difficult, but not impossible maybe. Oh, Jay Chung gets one shot. Enemy able to take one out, but time's running out. Javier, he has to stick this here. Oh, gets the nice kill. And Mayan tries to stick. Can't do it as Javier closes down the last two kills. That was really spicy though. Emmy with some sick long long distance plastic shots. To make and it a good really, ton really of damage right there. So this team pretty much isn't going to be able to bonus going into the next one. Yeah, they seem a little confused here. They're going to... Have to talk to each other first and see what their buy status is going to look like. Yeah, Elena? Uh oh. Alright. Elena's going like to gonna play whole minute pretty. <laughs> Alright. So it looks all like easy. they're going to play pretty reserved and only go in with a couple of pistols so that they can full buy next round. But 5 p.m. is on a full buy. No Easy day ass takes out beat. Captain Ouija. Are you gonna mute for this? Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Easy day spraying through his wall, not realizing that most of the team has rotated off towards mid, but now he's gonna rotate his attention. Silva takes one out, but then gets traded by Insight, and they're gonna push through that middle tunnel onto B site. But there's too many angles to watch here. There can only be one here. And 5 p.m. grabs their first round. They only lost one gun going into that, so they're gonna have a full buy here still. But since um, Riot Buddy is saved last round, they're gonna get a full buy here, and we're gonna see our first full uh, rifle v rifle round. Here. Here. This point in the game, we're already seeing Emmy pull ahead with four kills. Top fragger. Doesn't get spotted by the Silva Dart because it's poorly placed, unfortunately. And all that did was really tell 5 p.m. that there is at least Silva A main. Emmy spots J Chung in they main, and it, they hear a Silva drone come in. But there's two pushing in mid doors. But with that Viper wall, they pretty much all get onto site pretty freely. Captain Weezy again playing the same spot as last time, but gets taken out this time. Three of them on site, and we're gonna see an ult out of the Viper. Jicheng and Alura playing on that ult, trying to get close angles. Elena's done blending on back. <laughs> and Javi watching the flank in a main. One enemy remaining. Only Javi left here and still the swings on him that goes down. The first real gun round goes the way of 5 p.m. 
Gunner, what do you think on Breeze? Is Viper more powerful on A site or B site? As a defender. From your personal experience, professional experience. Gunner doesn't have time for us. Yeah. Gunner, four, four, five, six, eight. Final Tennessee. Gunner, four, five, six, eight. Gosh. Gonna be a lot of people here looking at the tunnel for the tube. Yeah. It looks like they're gonna try to push in A again, which play. they've been very successful at taking the site He's because. Gonna try to get a, a shot with the marshal here. See if you can get something for free. This is on Link. Link does not want to peek anymore into the marshal. And they're gonna blitz on A site with Mayan in his little Practice hidey hole. Point. Let's see if he can get some value. Yeah, That's one. On. Oh, oh, and that KO name lands straight. right on Emmy, taking her down to half HP. Mayan thought he had that kill and stopped spraying and went down for it. Now, now if Emmy, and if Emmy peeks that, she's done. She knows the one's up above her, waiting for that peek. Turns her back, hopefully not at the wrong time. Able to take one down, bring it to 2-2. Two, two. Yeah, gonna win the fight against the Marshall, but does get tagged, and now they're pretty injured on EasyJS. It's Link. He doesn't see what's coming, coming. and Jay Chung. But knows where Jay Chung is now. Time got an out though. Can't get the kill. And it looks That's like it's gonna down. be an RB round right now. Jay Chung goes down to the Phantom. Well, EasyJS survive with his one HP, and he does. That's good, because now he can buy going into this next round, and they can buy going into him. Yeah, they should be fine. They can all get guns, and they'll have another chance of taking a gun round, making it 3-3. Should be a pretty critical round. The team that loses here is going to be pretty broke. On my way. Yeah. Here. Actually, I don't and know. And looks like for once, um, Riot Buddies no, might be on towards B. Man can use his ult, so actually 5 p.m. is the economy next round might be fine anyway. They're just gonna ult on this site and be able to spot where everyone is, <laughs> but EasyJS throws off his ult, they know where he is thanks to Yuru. Spike down, B. He's only able to take one down though, and down goes his ult. One with his ult. Backside, gonna win against Captain Nice headshot. shot. Gonna go down though, and now it's a 3v3. Careful now. Javier droning out. Spike planted. Tags Link. Oh, and Link Link's gonna, gonna go down to the utility. And now Emmy. Emmy sees Jay Chung. Jay Chung sees her, but does not peek her. I don't Emmy's, blame him. Emmy's looking for blood, though. They're gonna push on together. Emmy and Man. Both of them Black. tagged. It. Emmy. Missing on Defiance side, Jay Chung missing on Emmy. As they inch closer, the time is ticking. Man, it's a nice kill. Emmy can't finish the kill here. Emmy, Emmy does remaining. kill Defiance side. Last player Man standing. goes down to Jay Chung in main, though, and I think it's going to be another RB. She round. has no time, though. And she might not make it out of here. Jay Chung oh. clutching out. <clears throat> Jay Chung clutching out two rounds in a row. As the last man standing. I see I'm not quite able to full buy going into this, but... They'll be fine, actually, because Man used his ult last round. Oh, wait, yeah, they can. Quite a lot of money. But Riot Buddies cannot. Yeah, Jay Chung can buy one person, at least, so it'll be an almost full buy. And Defy Insights is going to have to no make do with the Bulldog. But he does have his ult, so he can pretty much open a site with that. Looks like that might be on the dock. I wonder if Link's going to use his ult and push... Oh, here he goes! Link. He's gonna get some intel here at least, even if he doesn't do much damage. Ooh, almost kills Defiant Sight. Defiant Sight is left with only like 30 HP. Careful now. Ouija and we've seen there. this team pretty much commit to the site that they're at, so. Ouija just eliminates so No fuss made whatsoever. Link gets a spray <laughs> through the Viper Wall. Link is still alive here. No, they're long. planning sprays just a little too hot. Oh, it goes back and forth of Vincite. We get shot in the back, and Weezy's taking over from mid. Time to jump. Oh, yes. Face to face with Vincite. Oh, and Vincite gets out of the way, wow. but Sick kill Man knows door. exactly where he is. Only has to take three more down. Kill, so he gets traded out. 
I mean, he had three right. people from way different angles watching him. His uh, ads weren't too high there. And time against him. I mean, we talked about Econ. Now the Econ's actually broken. They can't get a full buy here. At the very least, Jeff and Sofa can, so... There. But they've bought in anyway, some of these players. I wonder if they'll sell, or they'll just try to do kind of like a gimpy half buy. Answer looks like a gimpy half buy. Yeah. Oh, maybe oh not. Easy day has last second buys into it. Yeah, but Sopa has nothing. Easy JS is gonna use this aggressively too. Try to get a pick to start the round off. Can't find anybody in elbow, even though they're all stacked up around outside of it. Toxins going up. And with Easy JS as well, they all fall back from B and are walking over towards A. Man, might see or a mid. ton of them here. If he turns, oh, the drone comes. Takes out. out the drone before it tags him. And TP's out of there. He has the info though, they, he knows they're not stacked outside of B and that allows some of the team to crunch down. Man, gonna try to reposition to a more aggressive angle here on A. He might catch them out here. They might not expect it, but they do with a knife. Thanks. Oh, Yoru blitzing on again. Luigi's dangerous when he has his ult. If Emmy and Link don't see this coming, it might be in for a surprise. I'm back. Looks like a surprise is what they're getting as he kills Link off at Orange, and now all three members of 5 p.m. are stuck back here near the bridge. They know where Ouija is, is though. One more. And so oh, uh, going down to Ouija now for the 3K. Ouija, what a great round for Ouija. Yeah, he's catching fire now, 10 and 7. Looks like RB chose this map for a reason. Because after a rough ish 2 2 start, they've just kind of stabilized the ship and winning every way. attack round now. Ouija able to get himself back site. We'll see if 5 p.m. has any answers for it. But this round, probably not. They all have ghosts and shorties. Except, Except for, for one, Emmy. One rifle. Which, if Emmy. anyone has a rifle, I want it to be Emmy. MAC's Viper's wall go down on A, and usually if this wall goes up, they commit, so we're probably going to see them push in and then the others push in from Welcome this. Welcome to my world! Looks like that's the plan. Thumb <laughs> goes down, and maybe they're just going to play it slow here and hope to get some picks. Oh, yeah, two picks in mid. Emmy, trying to look at Jacob's head, can't find it. Ko setting up to throw a flash right out of that ult. DJS sees the arrow, might get a free kill on Javier here. Oh, Javier he does. fully ready for it. He's gonna take the gun and run, but Emmy on the other hand might find it difficult to escape this situation. Because Uji hears her up in bridge and she might get stabbed here in the back. Oh no, and goes down to Ouija. He hunts her down and now Link, sheriff in hand. Gonna look for. Oh, does he spot him? Does he see him? Well, Link is on the same team as Jeff, so maybe not. But he. Oh, Jay Chung might peek him right now, though. No! <gasps> oh, no. There's only a sheriff on the bright side. He can still pull by this round, and everybody is gonna fly into this round, a pretty critical one, with guns. 5 p.m. looking to stem this tide because. <clears throat> because the side of RB has just taken five rounds in a row. Yeah, and we only have two rounds left after this, so whatever the economy is now, it's not going to be too great by the end of the half. So that means that Riot Buddies is going to be able to pretty much buy the rest of this game, this half. Boys and orb admitting. Setting up to go B, not necessarily their strong site, but... Javi spots two in tunnel. So he's gonna use his ult, but they might push him for mid and take him down. He actually gets silenced by the KO and then shot on the side. Oh no. Link swings mid though and is able to take down Captain Ouija. 
Goes down to Jay Chung though, and now Jeff back side. Ooh, takes a big shot, guys. Poison's off. All set up. Looking pretty impossible here. After Jeff spotted in the back side, they're just gonna go and avoid him. Man, scoping out from his spawn. Let's see if he can get this kill. On to Defiant they side, he moves to the last Here. second. They don't see each other because of it. <laughs> oh, and Defiant is just gonna stand here and wait. Thirty seconds left. Shot in the Spike side, planted. Though. They know he's there. They pinged him out. Jeff's they, gonna though? see him soon. Oh okay. no, Jeff turns at the last second. Jeff turns at the last second. Oh, but man has his back. And now two v three. They might fancy this one. Toxins going up. Jeff just misses the silver dart. Toxin screen down. No charges left. Oh, God is standing. Jeff switches to a knife at the wrong time. Cost him his life. Their economy isn't looking too great. They might go down this round as well, which Here. if I was them, I'd save for last round. Army's <clears throat> economy quite healthy. Laura's setting up her wall over on A, so they're gonna know off the bat that this is an A play. They've known multiple times though, and it hasn't stopped them. Who's yeah, next? Struggle to stop any sort of A aggression, and speaking of A aggression, especially when Ouija has his ult. Already on site, Ouija backside here sees Man. Oh, face the shot onto the clone. Man, gonna go up the rope. Ouija's gonna Missing. take him out. Easy for Ouija. That's two for Ouija. Emmy knows that he's close, but can Emmy stop him? The flash comes in. Emmy oh, takes him Finally, down. Goodbye, Ouija's rampage. The only one left. If she's able, oh, Judge. they had such low HP, ten and seven HP. She could have taken both of them down. The switch. We're sitting at a nine and two lead right now for RV. Jeff's not going to be able to buy full armor here. Does have his ult though, so might shut down a site right away. And if that were, if it were me, I'd be shutting down A, which he is playing this round. So you want to play? Let's play. And that's what we see. And with that ult, they'll probably rotate off. Luigi in the back out. While Jeff sits in his smoke, it's gonna be the whole team backing out. We just gonna go up tunnel though. Nick might spot him, or they see each other. No shot taken. Oh, Idiot. through the door. He uses the psychic. Emmy waiting for Ouija to peek from up on bridge. Sobo moves towards mid, thinking it might be an A hit, leaving the site fully unguarded. The fine side and Sopa meet each other in mid. Emmy here is Ouija. Standing ahead. Sopa's dueling in mid, but he might not realize the whole team is streaming onto the B site. The plant goes and they're going to get the plant down. Spike planted. Now we've seen lots of post plant play from RB on A, but we haven't seen a ton on B. Finds like it's a big chunk of damage on Man. Man shoots the Lurazinia in the head. It's a doable round to be last two. player they standing. They need this one desperately, but Jeff Shaw goes down, and now Man goes down two to Jay Chung, and it's a 10 to half. I think most people think this is an attacker side at half. Switching uh, map, sides. 10 2. A strong lead. Uh, I think at the very least, what you can say for 5 p.m. is they have a comp with two duelists. <clears throat> 
two duelists, a viper, and a chamber. I mean, sober to spot out people. I think they have a pretty good attacking composition. They do, but if they don't get pissed around, yeah, it's it gonna be, be real really hard. Difficult. They're gonna be fighting it until the very end. We're gonna see their Viper play on B2, just like EasyJS did. <clears throat> and most of uh, 5 p.m. set up to go B. Boys and orb emitting. Poison's off. Link rushing on the site. Weezy goes down, that's huge! Link with a great entry frag. And there is Xenia here, and that's five time, planted. wait for her team to join her. Hopes Bobby that Bear. she doesn't get flanked in the meantime. Mayan is on the mid flank here, Javier might not see this coming, could be lethal for him. Oh, Mayan's gonna whip! Oh, Javier's gonna whip too! Oh, good shot. Mayan gets the better of him. This is looking like a good pistol round. 5 p.m. needed this. Yeah, smoke. Can't get the kill on easy JS. Are we gonna see a flawless round? One enemy remaining. My... We do not. Link goes down, but we only lose one. It's alright. After that entry frag, Link did his job. <laughs> We saw lots of A play out of Riot Buddies last half. Do you think we're gonna see the same amount? I don't know. If Gunner were here to answer our question earlier, maybe we'd know if Viper <laughs> was better on A or B. We've seen both of these Pretty Vipers primarily play B. Well, this one is playing with a shorty. Let's see if Elurazenia can get any. Uh, here. Value they know at least one is B. But they're all gonna get decayed through it. Ouija does get a shorty shot. He gets two shorty kills. Quadruple barrel there. Oh man, spots Javier. Javier gonna go down to man on the lurk. Now two V three. Shorties in hand. Both of them with shorties in hand. Teleports ready. Link here is 1B, but is not paying attention to it. Both of them are going to come in from spawn. They're both just going to play for exit. One enemy not remaining. Really win this with Jordy. But they're both going to go down. Now, this is another important round for economy. We're probably going to see. 5 p.m. just bonus into this, but they're gonna go against full rifles. I wouldn't be surprised if Emmy does buy a rifle here, though. She does have. A lot she of might money. still have enough to buy into next Ooh, round she as buys well. Rifle, but also buys util and buys quite far down. They have a lot of confidence that she can make use of this rifle and keep it into the next round. Soba trying to decide what to do decides to follow um, his niece's footsteps. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Surprisingly. They're family after all. And here, Ouija though, looking for an early pick. Doesn't see anybody elbow. Mayan on the other side of the wall. Mayan's been there every round, but nobody seems to suspect it just yet. Fake teleport. Ouija's gonna hear them in elbow though. And most of them are rotating over to B, but they're not even committing on B. They're all going back over to A. They can rush on the A site and get a free site right now. Yep, and Mayan is just listening for info. He hasn't heard anybody because he's running watching, back as but... fast as he can, but they're still not on site, and it is real lucky that they didn't just flood onto the site and take it. Both of them the working slow. Out, yeah, they didn't flood on the site, and because of that, there's three already over here now. Be a four three four here with one lurking in mid. They're gonna take the site and play for main. But Jeff has the bomb. I'm gonna get it down. Now Link is gonna retreat the main. And it's 30 seconds left. 5v5 retake, but with man on the flank. 
I don't know just yet. Senior Senior goes down to Mayan's pistol. And now, 5v3. Big rounds with Emmy. Oh no. She goes down to the shot. One start. enemy remaining. And Javier, last one remaining. Gonna spray down Mayan here. Looking for a. You know where he is. Nice round from 5 p.m. Looks like offense is going very well for both teams today. Man doesn't need to buy into this, but decides to anyway. And maybe save his ult for next round, but maybe he's gonna play it. But Riot Buddy's economy is pretty broke here. They're gonna have to buy lightly to be able to full buy next round. He has round. his ult ready, and he's stacked outside the B site. Wouldn't be surprised if he just pops it. Goes out, oh, yeah. tries to get some damage dealt. Jeff doesn't decide to put his wall up, and it looks like they're playing it kind of slow here. Luigi's pushing up elbow, though. He could catch a couple of them off guard here. Oh, the smoke goes down from Luigi. Yeah, so he sees him, cuts him down <laughs> in his prime, and now Lurizinia tasked with a defense against four with a classic. I don't envy her position here, but she might get a kill! Oh! I can't find the headshot! And now, 5v3. Should be a pretty easy round. Yeah, and easy guess has an ult, but I want to play it here. Yep. And they're just gonna try to make sure they don't give up any guns. Last oh. player standing. Oh, uh, he jumps through the smoke line, gets cut down. The mine oh. is trying to find the head. Hits a shot through the wall, but it's not enough. Flawless round. No guns lost. Beautiful economy. Link just capped at 9k. We saw almost this big of a comeback from them yesterday, so I wouldn't be surprised as attackers if they can do it again. Yeah, I mean, they've clawed their way back from 2 and 10 to spitting distance now. 6 and 10. This is doable. And economy is on their side, especially if they win this round and they're able to take all their guns away. You want to play? That'll get them Let's another play. two rounds, probably. Jaechung playing on top of right side pyramid. He might find Emmy if she swings too far, but she's not going to swing at all. Now man up here in the tube misses the first shot, and Javier's not going to give him a second chance. Here. We're gonna have a uh, chamber v chamber oh, here, but Jay Chung looks oh, away. Him, but, kill him. but they know that they're pushing on the B now, and Jay Chung is able to take Mayan down. Shot. I heard that Teddy unmuting. Come on, let's go! Woo! Woo! Look straight on the side with his ult running. Can't see anybody to shoot though. Looking desperately for someone can't find a single soul. And losing it behind the wall. Dang and now this on. is the round that I would use my ult. If 30 I were seconds left. Easy JF. Yep. Yeah. It's gonna be a 4v5 retake. They're gonna need And to I probably would have put it down before I even planted. Now he has to wait kills. seven seconds. Link has huge now. kills this game. Oh my god, speaking of huge kills, Link is just a monster. One enemy remaining. Emmy. Easy JS does eventually ult, but not the at a point that it's not useful it's now. Easy JS though, it's doable. The yeah. Ult is gonna go down. They do know where he is. He gets remaining. another Emmy. Oh, Emmy. Thank God for Emmy's thing, aim. It was a risky peek. Risky he could have easily taken three of them out in a row. But you're gonna need a little bit of those risky peeks if you want to be RB at their own game. Yep. On their map pick. Man, though, on the lurker roll, 19 kills. Yeah, he's doing well. He's really bringing it back to the side of 5 p.m. A man just plays the lurker roll so well that it really makes a difference for their team. We get a chamber roll out of him as well, but he gets spotted by the Sova arrow mid. Wow, 
Viper all goes down from Blue Xenia. But it's not gonna stop the entire team of 5 p.m. from busting out on site. Easy with the flash and spray. Portal closed. I mean, he just got so disoriented from that flash. Man. Here. They mid. They, they know. Man, here's him up there. Oh, it's gonna be a refill for me, man. And Link. There we the go. We have a kill. game. Man, really coming alive on the second half as a lurker, but also linked with the entry frags and the site defense. We and might see them completely shut down, Riot Buddies. This yeah, half. RB just has no answers. Six rounds in a row. They thought they had a commanding. That's how I felt ag I playing against this team. No answers. We do have some ults, though, on their side. Insight, if he gets a hit here, he might automatically play his ult. He gets the hit. Those three of them are there. Doesn't throw off his ult yet, though. Surely they get more and more wary of man on the lurk. Here. But they have a good understanding of this B since Jay Chung is pushed up into A main and hasn't seen anybody in cave. So they have a big tilt towards B here. Javier holding elbow from Nest here. Take flight. Can a drone out? Not hearing anything, even though the drone, multiple are there. For some info, I don't think he'll even see a single soul. And now the movement towards B, it's going to be soon. It's going to be fast. Utility but they've been about to rain completely down. quiet up to this point. Utility raining down. Emmy gonna entry here. Insight does suppress three of them though. Blind. Down. It's like they both take two of them out, Ooh, but Emmy takes them out. Enemy remaining. And Mayan on the lurk again. And now 2v1. It looked terrible, but then Emmy pulled back the critical left. frags. That works. Emmy mean, gonna go for the plant. Mayan looking for JJ, trying to catch him off guard. Last do it and he does it again. Well, this suit is ruined. They just can't find Mayan and stop him from doing his thing this game. He's oh, always behind him in the shadows. Okay, back in. Oh. That was strange. Not gonna be able to get a buy here out of Riot Buddies. So, we might be seeing this at 10 10 next round. And the economy on behalf of 5 p.m. is so strong. Jay Chung gonna get here with the shorty, try to get a kill or two for free. Gets one. Gets one. TP's out. Really Gets spotted by uh, Silva and down. Has to jump his way out, but can't. Weezy trying to find some shorty pick here. Spike planted. To hit the shots, but Lurazenia can. They get slowed down though by the sniper. Emmy alone Smoke. on site. She's gonna have to make some plays happen. Dodges the flash. Nice spray down into Defiant Sight. Looking for some more. Nice headshot. Wow. What a clean end of that round. They're post plants. They're just as impeccable as the other teams were last half. 10 10. They're all tied up. And it's been. It's been a game of streaks. Eight rounds in a row for RB, followed by eight rounds in a row for 5 p.m. Both teams needing three more to win this. Not looking great for RB though, who has not won a yeah, I mean, round yet this RB, half. If they lose this map, they'll lose their map pick. And then they'll have to right. play on the 5 p.m. map pick. Joke's over! You're dead! He's holding out. Doesn't get hit. Actually gets a ton of damage down Jay Chung too. So if I'm just gonna stick to all no smokes necessary to get on site. Sopa can play post plant here, but gets taken out by Jay Chung. That's pretty unfortunate. It is, but the that could have secured them this round pretty easily. The clone is shot. Captain Weezy gonna try to work his way. Yeah. And Javi has his ult, so he could really yeah. spam that into a main and that. do some Weezy damage here. Man. 
He's been the hero of this half. Get another round here. He does get the shot. And he stays alive. It's big. Another shot. One enemy Easy remaining. Miss. Wow. Wow. It's 2v5 cleanup. It's insane. What Man, a cleanup. Huge headshots. And Easy Jay is coming through mid to clean yeah, up. Yeah, that mid up. flank, it just. That's what they needed. That was the only way they were getting it. And Easy just came in and got those kills. That round was insane. Man. Just I thought maybe I jinxed them. Level. And they yeah, were like, you're not jinxing us. This game. We've seen him have good games in the past, but not like this. He's been and we haven't seen Link frag so close to Emmy either. Yeah, Link's frags have just been super critical. I think. This team is really hard to play when you have people like Man that can play it slow, Jeff and Man, but then you have fearless entry fraggers like Link and Emmy to open up space for them. And that's important because EasyJS was playing that role, so to have Link who was able to step into that role and EasyJS swap oh, off of it. Javier is showing the man. Luckily he doesn't die, but Sofa does get a that's kill. A good spot. He's sprinting up on site. Bomb goes down. 5v4. Four, four, oh, five, or no, four ults on behalf of 5pm post plant. There is a looking for something, but I only have a Spectre. Link and EasyJS shutting it down. Last player oh, standing. Lurizinia goes down too. And now Javier, 6 HP, can't get the spray. He's going to try to save this gun for what could be the last round of the map. Oh, he's stuck on a pipe. He doesn't know how to run. <laughs> run, Javier. And Link is going to hunt him down. I mean, why not, right? They have the economy. They definitely Might as well go for the frag. Take away this gun. Link's checking every corner. Oh. But Javier does he turn his back at the wrong time? Oh, he doesn't even pick this corner. Oh, Javier! Oh, no! oh Link oh. takes him down in the oh, last Javier. second. That 6 HP was not enough to survive a single bullet. That and they have nothing. That gun would have been really nice here. Javier buys another Vandal, but no armor. Gonna be a naked Vandal here. And, a and we're only seeing judges. two Vandals. Now, Javier should really drop his Vandal down to Ouija. At least he can go in with full, full armor. Has the frags on his side. Revealing area. But instead, we're gonna see Ouija try to play it close here. Look, Dave Chung trying to play it close. He's gonna teleport away. The push comes in. Welcome to my An easy chance ult goes down on A. This is gonna be real hard. Trying to hop up on the bot. Almost gets his head cut off by the Sova ult. A gift. Sova's able to stay alive though yeah, and can play there. his ult. Oh man, he gets another pick. Man, on top of this, they're not- They didn't communicate with him, he's still there! Man gets three for free and nobody even turns to look in his general direction. You want to play? Let's play. Standing oh. ahead. What a critical juncture. Well, he pushes in is able to get that frag on Link. To make some plays, he's gonna but he's just not going to be able to do it here. Time is ticking away. And go on, go. Run. They're just gonna try to cut him down anyway. And attackers win. What a flawless match. half. One enemy remaining. So many rounds in a row at the end there. Eleven straight rounds to close out the map and take away RB's map pick. Man, thirty-one frags going absolutely insane. And that last round, oh, that last round was a heartbreaker. He got the first kill and nobody communicated where he was, and he got two more kills with people turned away from him. But I mean, after so many rounds of excellence, man, you deserve an, ex uh, an extra <laughs> lucky one too. And we saw pretty much the same performance out of them last night, so it's not a surprise as attackers that they were able to have this flawless half. We're gonna give them five minutes, but Pearl will start at 7.59. With Riot Buddies playing attackers first. You couldn't give him that extra minute. <laughs> <laughs>
1059 on the dot. Or 759. Gunner, Teddy, as fellow Final Fantasy Ers watching the other Final Fantasy team, do you have words of encouragement for RB to come back in map two? Wow. <laughs> Such supportive friends. Holy shit. Yeah, 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 what? Pay what? no mind. They're I'm busy raiding. What the heck? Use your timeouts. Some Let's happy words. Breathe. Honestly, I'm defending my boy Mike. We're typing in Twitch chat. So <laughs> we're, we're hyping uh, our. That's fair. That's fair. Why is your match history on the screen, Brian? It's embarrassing. No, I'm just kidding. Hey, I don't want to <laughs> talk about it, right? Hey, I won the last one, alright? There's a team MVP with 15 kills? Oh no! I think once they start getting rolled, oh, you gotta like, get away from that. Don't shoot the stop, take a breather. Yeah, don't show that one out. I do think, I mean, I think that's a really good point about using your timeouts. I don't think any team really uses them like like Nick's team was the only team that really used timeouts to so like stop momentum. It was but for like, a bathroom break. Yeah, but I mean like when you lose how many rounds in a row? Like you lose like we used 11 it. rounds in a row. We used it on our to last cut, game. Yeah, you have to cut that tide off somewhere, right? You have yeah. to try to like oh, I totally agree. settle down. And I can't believe they went 11 rounds without taking a timeout. I yep. think you should ask Mike on this matter because the the Mike timeout is the is the most important thing in a shooting game. If you're losing five or six rounds in a row, you take a good timeout and you reset. Yeah, the ship floats. Well, they're going to need to reset here, going into the 5 p.m. map pick. After losing their own Pearl, is going to be map two. And uh, 5 p.m. has consistently chosen Pearl this entire tournament. They're just exceedingly confident on it. But uh, I don't think it'll be a bad pick either for RB. I think RB is also quite fond of Pearl. Do you think we're gonna see any champion or like agent changes on Pearl? Nick, I know you play a lot of Pearl. No. No. <laughs> I honestly think it's gonna be the, uh, the same 10. We might, we might see EasyJS swap off of Viper though. But it will push Link off Phoenix if EasyJS goes back to Phoenix, and I think Link has been pretty strong on Phoenix. What a game for man though. If he can replicate that on Pearl, it'd be an easy win for 5 p.m. We're gonna really need to see a little bit of a, I mean, I don't think Pearl at least is as attack sided as Breeze looked like it was. <laughs> so we'll see if the game of streaks continues, but. Might be a test you on here. Too. I think the cool part with him is you'd expect because of the character him to be a little bit further back, but he was right up in there. I just think it was cool how, like, to see the play differences from, like, Jay Chung and Mayan, both on Chamber, but Jay Chung played Chamber, like, how I kind of expect Chamber to be played, like, you know, really eager to get picks. He went up on that pyramid to try to get a pick one time, like, trying to like fish for for early round picks man didn't really play it like that he he played it a lot slower um especially on the attack side he lurked every round like got trusted his team to get on site and once they did he made his move and pincer like three of them at once super effective this game and I'm, I'm excited to see like i mean if they play the same character again are we gonna see the same thing on pearl where man is lurking like crazy on pearl where jay chung is trying to find picks and man is getting the better of, I mean, not just Jay Chung, but the entire team, because they're not expecting where he is. I think that last round was super emblematic of it, popping up on box and having nobody report his position as he sprays three of them down. I think the crazy thing is, I think the winning team is going to get the most CT rounds this game, the most defense rounds. Both both teams look like laser focused. Their aim looked tight. 
uh, on offense, but both teams still struggled on defense. So if either one could pick up like five or six, <clears throat> they set them up so well. Even like four. Alright, is anyone gonna do it? I'll do it. I've always wanted to be a streamer. All right. Skinja, thank you for the five gifted subs. <laughs> five tier subs to J Hoops, Ido Ruler, X Tate, Hurricane, Ev Ebibin. Vibin, bro. Vibin. Hurricane <laughs> Vibin. Bro. Deathhead. All right. Betty, can you thank our sponsors? Hold up. All right. Specs ready. Let's see if these teams are ready to go for map two. <clears throat> Both teams are ready. Three, two, one. Let's we'll see if we see a closeout or see us go on to map three. Mandy, Easy JS, back on the Phoenix, link on the See, bib. I caught it. And that Sober is changing too to the Sage. They have a specific map, uh, specific comp prepare for Pearl. And they're gonna do it every time. And if I remember correctly, this is the map, one of the maps that we lost against 5 p.m. Looks like everybody on RV is going to stay the same, except for maybe Weiju hasn't locked in yet. And I'm thinking, does he think about the Neon here instead of the Yoru? The Yoru oh, I think we might see him on Rage. We might, yeah. Pearl's not a bad map for Rage. Oh, it is. It's the Rage hover now. I was 20 seconds to decide. Select your agent. Locks in on it. Got some really unique comps here. Chamber is the only overlap. I seem to be saying that a lot about Chamber, but, mm -hmm. you know, good agent, I guess. Huh. And when you're good on him, you can be really unstoppable. And that's what we've seen out of Mayhem. I think you've seen it out of Jay Chung consistently, too. Both I agree. Both these on Chamber forces to be reckoned with, even if they play him in different ways. We'll see which Chamber gets the greater foothold this game. That's not ready. Teleport's ready. All set up. I'm getting a little deja vu here seeing Mayhem playing <laughs> Chamber, Mom Pearl. Have a couple of feelings. Good kind of deja vu or the. No, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no kind of deja vu? Yeah, the oh no. Gonna lean towards the A site here. Smoke wall down from the Viper. Emmy on the defense. Emmy has the aim here, but Jay Chung has his pistol. Silence is on. The detector down in pit. Oh, he doesn't kill off the stone. Oh, can't kill off the fire inside too. Man, gonna get tagged by the tripwire. Sopa gonna run over, grab up the ghost. They don't see him grab the ghost. Oh, he reloads before shooting. But he can't get any value. 
Link goes down. Man, I'm gonna take Javi, but then Insight gets him with his little it. sneaky hiding spot. Oh, gets tagged here too. Soba has his wall. He could wall this off and get this defused. Whoa. They might be able to jump over it here. Yeah. Oh no. Does Jay try and get Yeah, they can both jump onto it. Oh no. I would have um like cornered myself in there. Mm -hmm. But when you have to think so fast and put it up so fast with yeah, the rest of I them mean, peeking you. It's a pretty reasonable thing to do. You see an opening, you see an entry right yeah. like, hmm. And in practice, I remember hearing Queen Salvi say, like, it's really hard as Sage on this map because so many places you can just jump over the Sage wall. So we'll see if Sopa comes up with some smart ones that actually blocks them off. Link. We're seeing the same play out of them. All on his own. <laughs> Link playing super no, close, but Jaytrunk swings on him. With a Marshall, and they take no this side again. Same playing spot. Spike planted. More of them playing on site this round rather than falling back though. Emmy with the classic. Jay Chung another martial pick. And we're gonna go down to Ouija. Last player standing. Just we're Jeff, seeing just Jeff. 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 Oh. I respect the hustle, but O2 is gonna be the first gun round for. 5 p.m. and a bonus for RG. I mean, I know from both of these teams that attackers seems to be their strong side, so... It was the case, too, in the earlier series, right, Gunner? Um, was it just Icebox or was it both maps that they had, like, a really strong attack? Actually, there's three maps for you guys, right? And Jeff's on Phoenix, able to just push in, risk his life because he can ult in and get those frags. It's so important. Launching smoke. I think all the games that we've played have been, we're all like attackers sided. Oh, ping's not gonna get it. They go for the third oh, play over here on A. Oh, Jay Chung getting so many martial shots. Man, no entryway for him. Last player so standing. gonna lose the gunfight to Defy Insight, and now it's Mayan Teleport's versus ready. four. All of them exiting sight. He's gonna try to fight it out a little. Here's Jay Chung running back and forth. Knows where he TP to. Jay Chung's pretty hurt. The man seems to have no shot in this round. He's gonna go and try to save this Phantom. I'd say we here too, but had he peeked Jay Chung, he could have taken him out and cost them a weapon. Laura, oh, almost going down to the bomb. And I think out of most teams, we've also seen a really heavy A side on here. Okay. More A takes than B takes, especially with that long, no, long, way reach. open line of sight over on B long. This is also split, though. two over on the B side, two over the A side. I've noticed that. Oh, oh nice, Teddy. Oh. A lot of people just naturally gravitate towards A site. A lot of they people don't want that long peak. Line. Right. They don't got the confidence, but here on the B site, Spike planted. down, and now Emmy, <coughs> Mayan, Mayan with the ready. Phantom, Emmy with the Deagle. And here we go, try to make this happen. They got B site, but they took more casualties this round than any other prior to getting the bomb down. Mayan's gonna slow walk as he waits for his teammate. Now it's gonna be a push through. Oh, the oh, chamber trap does spot yeah. Reina though. And now Javi knows exactly what's up. 
So if they both the swing him. Sure, he's sitting in the cubby. Yeah. So they have to know that he's there first thing. Jay Chung, oh, am I? An... Oh, he does peek him. Standing. And it's gonna be Emmy and Mian going down pretty quick and easy. 4-0 start. Still gonna see a buy into this. It looks like from 5 p.m. Not quite a full buy. Mian's not gonna be able to buy. Doesn't have his ult either. It's three orbs away. EasyJS does have his ult though, so I mean, we might see him Sofa push them right away. Sofa buys four man and buys himself a spectre. Eat your own heart Not a bad play. I think we're going to see EasyJS ult right into this though. Yep, yeah, and here he goes. And this was an effective play last time. They got a couple picks but by pushing this. But doesn't see Raze in the corner and gets taken out by Captain Ouija. But he does pretty good damage to... <clears throat> Going up. Pretty and good knows damage. that they're there too, right? So got intel out of that as well. And here on the backside, Mayan trying to bottle them in a little bit. He's gonna play the slow, like the lurker he is. Here's them coming, but oh, J Tang doesn't even. It. He but he wide swings and is still able to get that peeker's advantage on him. But they know that they're full committing to B now. Swing wide into the opening, get cut down. Captain Weezy has an ult, gonna take no one down with him. Surprised that Jeff didn't die to that. Oh, yeah, I agree. Ooh, I think it's two. Double spray down. Important, she too. Ult, yeah. Ult. Surely she possibly. Javi has very play. low HP, too. This is. Link. Oh, Chamber Link. half exactly HP. Right. Oh, Emmy just needs to spray oh, into that Javi, and get some kills. Oh, he wins it! Oh, Emmy's able to take that old down. Knows where Javi is, but gets Javi, taken down. Big headshot. Oh, that round could have been really different if Javi went down there to Link, but agreed. But he gets the headshot on Link, and then it's just too hard for Emmy, even if she's popping off. And I think we're gonna see a conservative buy from 5 p.m. here, so they can full buy into next round. That's a good spot. Sierra and five. Jay Chung seven and zero right now. Killed that. Three of them look like they're pushing mid. Four of them, Damn. so it seems, but don't see anybody just yet. Oh boy, yeah. this is gonna get interesting. Oh boy, oh boy. Yeah. I'm gonna get Javi, who gets easy JS. Javi's gonna call oh. four of them behind. Man tried. Last Player standing. Now, uh, Sopa down. Uh oh, Emmy. <clears throat> it's all right. It's a save anyway. Classic in hand. Try to get one, but they're gonna run away from her. Spike planted. Now, if Emmy were smart, she'd push where that gun was yeah, down. Yeah, that gun, right? Yeah. But unfortunately, she doesn't opt to do that. Also, run over to the B site. Maybe get another kill and take away a gun. She's still smart though, even though she didn't do that. Mm -hmm. Oh, Alur and her just miss each other, but Alur's gonna hear that drop. Looks like yet again another A setup. And why not? They get it. Oh, Laura with the bomb. Are they thinking about going B? No. Maybe? They are so dead! Launching smoke! Link and drop some smokes down at the corridor. We get an all out of my end, but. His ult kind of becomes a little Molly. useless if he is playing on B and they're going A. Ooh, look at this though. Jeff Shaw rotating to their spawn, killing off the trap. They know he's there now, but they're also <clears throat> a little terrified and have to keep an eye on that back door. Yeah, he, he does fall back, but... Yeah, that's pretty clever. 
They make he makes look think, at them. Two of them just waiting for him. Yeah, he makes them think that he's still back there, but instead he's resetting the play now and pushing numbers towards the A site. Another smoke they goes still down from they still don't want to full commit and turn their backs. But they have four. Oh, seconds. but they finally do. Plenty of time. Here's Ouija. He's gonna prep some blast packs sooner rather than later, but. 30 seconds on the clock. They're going to have to make a play soon. Might at this point probably know the 30 second 30 mark. Seconds. They're going to pop everything. Nades back sight. The KO running. Ouija and Defiant Sight are the first in. They're going to get Link. Push to the back sight. And the full sight take. Venus, you can get it. Jeff goes down. The goes down. Man, trying to get shots. They can't find it. So was so either. off by a poison. Field, I guess. And here, May and Alt running, trying to just find somebody to shoot. And on the other side of that wall. Grabs a gun though. Alt sees J Chung. J Chung swings and gets double peaked and, and goes um, down. Sopa. With the Sopa does have gun though. Looks like he's just going to save it. Look at this fan skin. How do you feel about these, this skin line? <laughs> so Reminds cool. me of Nickelodeon. <clears throat> when you kill someone, does it like spawn a slime zone above them? <laughs> that should be, I mean, that should be the kill animation. Oh my god, right? I remember. For that. Wait a second. Wait a second. <laughs> for, for that. All this time? True calling. It's actually a Buzz Lightyear collab. <laughs> oh yeah, it came out with the movie release, right? <laughs> We're seeing a little bit different of a play here. Looks like they're gonna go towards B. They did get that ult out of Mayan, so you will don't have to be afraid. And J Chung does have the team nice ult, so this is a good place. time to go B. Sopa gets the wall down, but they're able to take it down real quick before it hardens up. And he gets silenced, so he can't put down the slope so. So it's given the sight, they're gonna play for the retake here. Oh, Sopa almost killed Ouija with a blind spray through the smoke. They get that bomb down and fall back. They're all gonna hold. <gasps> oh, Ouija goes and kills off ECJS, and now 4v5. Emmy has oh. ult available. Oh, Ouija just taking people out one by one. Sopa is trying his hardest to. And they have so many nades and mollies they can play on this bomb. You know where Emmy is. Somebody get this. I mean, they're doing damage. It's just not enough. And it's not quick enough. <clears throat> Eight and zero for RB. I mean, it's not over yet. We saw it's not shoot. over yet. I would like to see them get at least this. one or two, though. I mean, I think it's going to be pretty difficult yeah, I mean, to make it come back if they get a close out here. Yeah. I'd like to see two, and I'm sure they do, too. But here we go. Another A setup. <clears throat> and it looks like they're going to play pretty much towards A as well. Who won the first map? 5 p.m. Uh, 5 p.m. They, they had an the epic comeback. Match. 5 p.m., yeah, was down 10 2 in the first half and they came all the it way. It came back. back flawlessly. Right, 13 10. 11 rounds. Damn. Around. Yeah. And this one, they're also down quite a lot, so. Good happen. Going up! Yeah, one second. Fire in the hole! Oh. Link gets taken down by Luigi's ult. Poor Link. Easy JS, only of the classes. Oh, he swings! Swings at the perfect time to take Ouija down, but Jay Chung trades the first two. Oh, Emmy, nice kill. Oh, Emmy kills the Lord. Oh, oh, oh last player down. Here. And now behind them. Sopa Sopa. has oh. Oh, Javi doesn't know. One enemy remaining. Oh, Sopa is able to take Wait, down Sopa Javi. Sopa has ult, though. If he could actually he get to the He does. Don't know if he can, though. He wants oh, to. Oh, and then sits behind I the box. Planted. He's gonna hit the red. It's on ECJS. He doesn't yes, the and they get the round. Sopa. 
What a critical slant by Sopa. Give him all the time he wants to pick whatever to god in the store. <laughs> He's like, this is my reward. I'm going shopping. I am not just your healer. It's the important Sopa round. family at, top, at the top right now. We can thank the man himself for gifting them around with a big for flank sure. in the 2k. They almost have a full buy, and Link's just gonna have to play half shields here. Soba's gonna put his wall up at the very beginning of this round, allowing it to harden up <laughs> before they're able to take it down right away. Come on, let's go! JS gonna pull out for info. Watch your eyes! Luigi knows exactly oh, where he's coming from. Defines I could have left it. We're taking lots of mid presence here. Sopa, does he know that so many people are gonna leak through? He sees the gun. Oh, can't kill Javier. Can't really do that much damage out of there. Not all four pushing through mid, but Emmy hears this. Do they expect Emmy here? Above her head! Oh, no. It actually didn't do that much damage to her somehow. And cool. we have 4v3, 3v3. Heaven. Link. But this Viper ult's gonna make it difficult. I mean, does Link know? They didn't really communicate, and Link gets shot in the side. And Laura's playing super close here. Anyone that peeks this corner. It then picks up my end. He's a JS, takes out a lure, breaks down the ult, but then exposes himself completely. 9-1. It's seen worse. Are we gonna see them go back to A here? What do you think? Here. It looks like they're tilting that way. Now that they know that the Phoenix ult is gone and they can't get a free pick like that, they're a little more inclined to go that direction. Phoenix is gonna reposition to B. And he might try to get a flank like he did in one of the earlier rounds where he killed off the alive utility and made him like really hesitant to wonder. Site. That works. Down. Link playing in this cubby again, which makes it really difficult to get any sort of cover in one space spot, yo. Oh, he wants to pass Oh, beautiful, but he can't get the shots. I like the thought of Link, though. That could have been a really nice round. Spike planted. Emmy can't do much of the classic there. And Sopa. Last player standing. Just so far. round. Then they have one more round to grab another round, making it 210. Last round in the half. And they both have full buys going into this, so. They really need this round. If you go into the second, I mean, 210 is already pretty terrifying, but if you go into the round 111 and you lose the pistol, it's pretty much game over. <laughs> Jay Chung gets rid of his op so that the other team cannot find it. And they're setting up towards you want to A. Play? Let's play. How are they going to play Lurk Roll here, though? Smoke's down. Link's playing back this round. Ooh, the Razor. She flies on Which the side is... looking for anybody to shoot. Thank God Link wasn't there this round like he was most. But they are going to get a bomb down. Oh, but this criminal is going to do some damage. Yeah, take down on Laura. Do some damage to... The Defiant side takes one back. It's still a four though. They still have the numbers here. Emmy's starting to pop up. Insight playing in the cubby, so when they spot him, he's stuck. Now we just have Chamber. Just Jay Chung. But and this smoke's gonna down. block him. Oh, He's gonna spray. He might push through, but Link get him before. It... Oh, Link doesn't get him, but Emmy does after the defuse. That was a round they needed, so this will be Switching interesting. Do you think we're gonna see as much a play out of this team? 
I, I think uh, we'll see more A play out of this team, honestly. <laughs> Almost every round they'll go away, I'm sure. Jay Chung is gonna try to hold down B all day with this off and Marshall. And I think mid and A are probably the, the focal point for 5 p.m. on this attack. 5 p.m. has the aim, though, to be able to play and take long B. Even though this pistol round might not necessarily mean the end of the game, it means something pretty close to it. So yeah, that's to, important. They really have to take this, but if they can take this and make it 410 after the. Ensei might goes. know that they're here when he throws this knight. Doesn't get anyone, but all three are gonna push them. They, hear they don't clearly. see anyone. Oh, but oh. He, he does. And now they're gonna push back though, instead of falling back to the site. Nades and the slow uh, <clears throat> poison field are gonna hold it off. Man, lurking again in mid. We've seen this before on a different map, but here he is doing it again yeah. on Pearl. Let's see if he can be as much of a menace as he was on Breeze. That looks like the full rotate over to B, and Jay Chung gonna be ready for this. He's gonna hear them soon, and they might not realize he's behind this pillar so close. He could teleport away. He's gonna, I bet he gets kill. at least one kill here. Surely he does. It's gonna be one, and he's gonna be free. He gets some damage taken, but not too much. They know where he is now, though. Yep, and it's a 4v3. Man. And Plaren Wall from Silva forces them to go into two spots and instead of three. Ouija in heaven gets a kill. Now Link coming for Ouija. Can't kill Ouija. It's a 2v2. Ouija brings a 2v2. Oh, Last man. Player standing. Does get the better of Ouija. And now it's a Ouija here down on the side. Silva takes her down. Swings the class. Teleport's ready. That was a round they needed, and they got it. Can they have another flawless attacker side? That's yeah, pretty much what they need here. Yeah, definitely wouldn't put it past them. They have the brim for smokes on this map. They have a, I mean, they have a really strong attacking setup. Smokes and flashes from the Phoenix, and we've got uh, Reyna, the, I mean, on Emmy, who just can go absolutely lethal on that character. I think that. There's a good chance that they win this round, they can string together a few more at least. Maybe make it into a deja vu moment from Breeze. Oh, Silva Arrow spots Easy JS and Sopa. So they're gonna fall back a little. Look how close Mayan is though. <laughs> Javi. Oh, Javi, Javi knows he is sure there he though. That. Javi's just like waiting with the class. Yeah, but it, it sticks Javi there, right? Like Javi can't swing this. Mm -hmm. He just has to wait patiently or that's gonna spot him. The Fiance, like they're double holding this door because Javi knows, but no one's peeking just yet. But is Mayan gonna get baited into doing it? No, he has so I much. I don't think so. Push. I mean, why would he? It closes that off as a rotate spot. Yep, and he's gonna walk A short instead. Gonna make sure to avoid any darts. That dart is shot way back there in the spawn. And now the smoke wall. Let's see, man. Can he get a kill here? Oh no, the knife is off for own to The fine side, he just turns at him and is like, wait a second. Ouija might go down. No, Ouija gets him. Nicely placed nade in classic. He's only left with 60 HP though. Left. So the wall's off, but not oh, quite good yeah. enough. However, it might make them funnel into just that one spot, so it could work on their behalf. But they're falling back. Are they gonna save? Spike planted. Definitely not. Standing they only ahead. have classics and shorties. They're gonna go for a play, but is there really? Are they just gonna try to, to do damage? Oh well, here we go. J Tongue's getting a gun right here. Now this wall really does make them funnel into oh. that one spot. Oh. Ooh, he gets a headshot. Javi actually did get a headshot there. Didn't do much damage, but let's see it. Play. Stuck on sight. Out of charge. They know multiple are there. CJS gonna swing. Emmy takes two of them down. Sprays back and forth. Clean round ish. <laughs> 10 and 4. Now, I think Easy JS and Mayan have to buy into this. They know they're going up against a full rifle buy. They don't have too many rounds to burn. I Mayan's blame gonna them. eco though. But I don't know. I guess for the util, because if you're buying this slow, you might as well go rifle. He didn't have enough to do it. Necessarily, only at 2400 with the util, but Sopa could have bought him instead. Thank you. Oh. Sopa buys Emmy. 
Silva says, I'd, I'd rather buy my cousin. Or niece, yeah, we, sorry. I think they, they dropped the spectrum they got wasted. Oh, man goes down to Javi. Wow. Oh, no. no. Brings it to 5 3. This is. Planted. They do get the spike down, though, so if they are just good at holding off this retake. Cheeky frag there from Jay Chung. He's gonna look for a couple more. Ouija oh, Ouija takes down Emmy. All of them pushing in. Oh, Easy JS, low oh, HP. Oh, and now. Oh, oh god. Thank god Link, Link has his what back. It lets Easy JS come all the way back. Wow. And they. Wait, Easy wow. JS is so big brain. He ults there. He goes Link down, protects damage, him. Right, the crossfire keeps him safe. They thought it was safe to push him, and you know, every time that happens near you, you're like, Haha, I'm gonna stab this guy with my knife. Yeah. Oh no. That was some great teamwork, and they got them the round. Wow, brilliant. And that was important. That's crazy. They, they're, they should have by no rights won that round, but EZJS <laughs> and Link just summoned it out of their butts. And, and it forces. RB into an eco here. Yeah, pretty sketchy round. Is this With the some... first full buy for PM. Deja vu from Breeze. Oh Not gosh, like I, ho this. I hope so. <laughs> I mean, I hope we see, you know, a 10 10 game at least, and then it falls where it may. Ooh, Three of them, yes. four, five of them pushing into mid. Busting through. Easy to ask. Is gonna get that frag, but they probably know now that five of them are through Wait, mid. If they if Defiant side goes underneath, he's gonna get oh god. Surely. Oh, he they spot him, but they don't get to take him down. Now like they're how, entering A for mid. I like how she slowed that field, like even though you have to crouch under that and go slow anyway. <laughs> or slow the like little. Planted. And they don't quite get him. Do they? Are they gonna give up on him being there? And this gonna flash through. Are they gonna play off of that flash? Inside's trying to swing that cubby, but gets taken down by Link. Enemy remaining. And just stay down there. Oh, Jaechung takes two of them. Makes it expensive for them. Silva slows them down, which is important. Jaechung just trying to cost them some more cash. He's gonna do another. I mean, why even peek at this point? Wait for the defuse. No one else could do this. Oh, there. Beautiful teamwork. But it, I mean, Jaechung though did a really good job making that ridiculously expensive. That's three guns they took away. Yeah, and Sopa gave him up a gun by just sitting there, full swing, yeah, ready it, for to be peaked. Yeah, even though 5 p.m. can still buy, and it wasn't the end of the world for them, those three guns mean a lot because everybody could look like J, uh, Easy JS right now. They could have like right you know, three thousand, four thousand credits with a gun, but instead now they're at like one thousand, and if they Teleport's lose, ready. they might not be able to full buy. Better. Not to mention the emotional damage that Jaechung pulled out there. <laughs> Revealing area. Jaechung and Weiji definitely carrying this team. 23 and 22 yes, kills each. Wow, Easy to ask an things. Emmy. That Javier Dark ping four people. But does that mean that he can actually win the fight? He's gonna get flat. Oh, no, he's not. Nice kill in his But Emmy and Sopa with the double trade. And then Weiji. Oh, they're getting choked off here though. And they split Link off from his two teammates. Inside, trying to play. Man. Here on A main, Defiant side Total doesn't expect it. Jason's gonna rotate off of B finally. A from Luigi. Not gonna do too much here. Here. We do does have an ult here, so we might see him blast pack into sight and hopefully take at least one out. If they play choke points here though, he could grab two of them. He's gonna blast pack out and side peek. He's not gonna see anybody though. Sopa looks like he's not peeking this time, so. Satchel out. Whoa. Yeah, blast Emmy is stuck in this corner window. though. And Jay Chung is ready for her. They're not giving up anything right now. Oh, Jay Chung gets out before Emmy swings on him. Down to half HP. And they're- Oh, Ouija is able to get the peek! 
still an exercise in frustration as they can't stop the bomb defuse. Gonna give nice. yet another round over to 5 p.m. They're on the but comeback trail. This feels all too familiar for us. And it's probably super frustrating. Two times in a row. Here they go. They there call a go. timeout. They're hoping to get some mental reset here. Yeah, the, the classic Yo Betty White timeout. Nick, there. are you excited that no, another team has seen the way? it's just a waffle cake timeout. <laughs> yeah, the waffle cake? All right. What are the encouraging Here. words Javier called the timeout? So we can only assume Javier is the one, the floor general here. Giving Javier. them the pep yeah, talk right giving now. Giving them the heads up. What do you think Javier is saying right now? Nick, there. can you give us the, the insider scoop? I think Javier is telling um, there. the team about Dasani purified water. It's enhanced with there. minerals for a pure, fresh taste. It comes in a 16.9 fluid ounce bottle, and you can get it at McDonald's for too much. Dasani. Wow. It's the Brian, you want to hold down a uh, tab here so we can check out some of these scores while yeah, we're waiting? 24 kills for Weijin, 22 for Jay Chung. I mean, mid, they've lost mid control into A. Twice. I mean, that was, the, that was the hand way, right? When you guys played on this map, I saw you guys push mid like every round, take full control. Yep. You you would smoke out like, you would smoke out like the, I don't know what it's called, window or whatever? Not window, like whatever that main passage is. Yeah, mid is everything on this map. Yeah, and to give that up. Jay Chung knows it. that too, because when yeah. I was practicing Ooh, with nice him, he, he's the one that told us. I think what the defense needs to do is either take the mid, or they just need to try a couple gambles. Yeah, oh, here's a, stack, here's stack a, a sites. Odin, Javier, it's the Hobby Classic. Let's see if we can get a tag and spam through something with this Odin. Oh, he's gonna get a lot of people oh, mid. Oh boy, Insane he does. Mid. But what can he do? Now, with if it? they're smart, they're gonna fall back though and reset, right? Yeah, that's what Hobby's gonna do. He's gonna give them a little bit of space and set up here with the Odin. Oh dear, it's an Odin. Oh, it's Hobby time. Oh no, but Emmy gets him through the, the smoke though. Nice swing through the smoke for Emmy, and now they're all gonna stream through except for Mayan, who, the hunt begins. as you expected, is mid. Hey, Mayan here on the lurk. Oh no! Weezy oh. doesn't get the kill! Doesn't, does some damage, but doesn't get the kill. They get him to play. 4v4. Emmy, Emmy here is Weezy. Pop over that wall, but he gets her. But nice kill from Ouija. Now this is so gonna be cool. hard. They know that they're on the bottom. Link's playing as ult nice is definitely gonna take a lure out. She does get it half. Last player standing. But Link's the only one left. One V1. It's gonna be the one V1 here. Link's gonna swing peek even yes. though he wasn't on the bomb. Yeah. And Jaychun's gonna take the round now. 11 7. Finally, they stopped. The rampage from 5 p.m. Six rounds in a row at 5 p.m. But this round, the 11th on the board, inches them ever closer to actually forcing a game three. That was and really 5 p.m. Though. If they don't take this round, then they can't buy next. Yeah, I mean that was really testy though. For a round <laughs> that they took back to make it 11-7, like uh, that was really close. It looks like that's a good spot. Uh, I'm too far. RB a run for their money every time on attack. Teleport's ready. You want to play? Let's play. J Chang holding. Gonna watch B long. Javi doesn't spot anyone mid. Oh, Emmy moves out of the line of sight just in time. Even though two are mid. Javi doesn't spot them. Joke's over! You're dead! Oh, easy JS. We're gonna see it all out of easy JS. Oh, but Insight sprays him through the smoke and takes him out. Now they can still plant this outside of this ult though and use the ult to their advantage rather than against them. Yeah, easy JS though, gonna reset this. And go slowly, just gonna sprint it here back to his spawn. Gonna see if they can catch them out on a rotation, but the Viper ult went down in A, so it's the logical thing to do here. Let's see if they can get some value. EGS though, gonna creep back over to the A site, letting his team bait and pretend that it's going to be. Now Laura's gonna left. stay there in her ult. 
Now, when Easy Jazz hears this go oh, down, he might push into that, but. Maybe. And here he is. Oh. She's all still up. So there's Zinia. She has her back to him, too. If oh, he no. pushes in fast enough. This could be really oh, oh, he oh, missed yeah. a fight big. He really the The res goes down. But Alurazina gets another. Alurazina gets a fourth. Gets taken down, but not enough time for the plant. The damage has been dealt, and that's 12. Oh, that was a harsh round. Alurazina was the hero there. Half her kills in that round, but those kills were extremely important in the 1v4. Such a smart ult, too. And if you're Viper, you're definitely playing most of your ults over on A, right? When attackers so heavily depend on A to get the plant down. I was going to send his drone into mid again. Oh, sees Easy JS's feet, so he knows at least one is mid. But meanwhile, Link is able to push mid doors, and so is Mayan. Luigi takes him down, but Easy JS takes down Javier. And now, can Luigi get more kills here? No, he gets sprayed through the wall by Easy JS, who sees it coming. Number of Vans here, they might be able to keep themselves afloat here. Ouija has dropped 30 kills, but those 30 kills are all dead and gone for this round. Look at Jay Chung here on top of this box, though, on B. Just... And they haven't really pushed Jay Chung on B yeah. yet to know that he's been playing here. 5 p.m. just waiting for mistakes here. Haven't seen. They am playing the lurk yet. role, but no one's pushing into him. It could be here. Easy JS. Gonna walk it out out of A short here. Oh, Emmy gets nice. the peek on insight. Insight's not dead. 30 yet. seconds left. The flash goes down. Going up. Where's the bomb? Oh, Ooh, insight sprays through the firewall. Does some damage. Not enough though. He's still stuck there, but man yeah, on right. the flank. Gets one. Oh, it's shot on the side by Jay Chung. Doesn't really see him coming. But now Jay Chung to find insight here. Behind the site. Jay Chung's got 24 so far. Can he get number 25? Maybe 26 and 27? Who knows? He's gonna play this faster if he wants to catch him off guard, yeah. though. So far, can he win the gunfight? Go down to Jay Chung. Now, one oh. Jay Chung dies easy JS. 12A, and they still have a little bit of life in them. That last gasp. In fact, they have a full buy, but on the other side, RB doesn't have a full buy. Nope. Spicy. But if they don't win this, or if they take too much damage, they won't have a full buy next round, so... Yeah, they're definitely on the ropes, but we've seen crazier comebacks for them. Very, very and they need all four rounds to even bring it to overtime. They can't even win with those four. They cannot mess up. KO does have an ult over on A. Captain Ouija also has his ult again. Not seeing any ult over on 5 p.m. Yes, picking up the ult point. Now he has ult available. Come on, let's go. And here he goes. The blitz down his side. Get shot in the side by Divine Center. He knows which side they are, and Emmy trades off that information. Careful now. Big plays. Soba throws yeah. up this good wall, unique wall, but... He's gonna give a free plant to Soba. And now, the 4v5 retake. Can they finish it off here and avoid another round or two of struggle? None of them have been able to push off of the site into Emmy their direction, though. Now, if we see ults on the site here, though. Man gets one, but it's just a 2v1. We're down to game three, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, shit.
Yo, that 10 2 spice, though. <laughs> that is scary. <laughs> Uh, Which side is on attack this time? Uh, RB started to attack this time. Again? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, dude. <laughs> Repeat. <laughs> All right. It's tied at 1 1 apiece, and the last map is the center. As Gunner and Teddy call it, Ass Cant or whatever. Yeah, freaking Ass Cant. Yeah, Ass Cant. Yes, yeah, can't handle these nuts. Now it's gonna be RB starting on the defense side. 5 p.m. They get their first shot at attacking. Given how good these teams have been on attack, I think setting the momentum. We haven't seen 5 p.m. be the ones to set the momentum on attack. Maybe that's the key. Maybe they get it rolling early, demoralize the crap out of the other team, and finish it off in game three. Who knows? Or maybe RB. And steady the ship and finally fend off an attacking side for good. And if they can do that, it could be an easy map on ascent. How do you feel about these teams stealing each other's map picks though? RBP, <laughs> Breeze, and losing on Breeze. 5pm picking Pearl and losing up Pearl. Maybe that sets up the precedent it's the for- the attacker uh... side. I think it's, all, it's like map or not, I think it's all been just in the- what's been going on in the defense from RB and what's going on. I think they're figuring it out though, so that's a thing.
come back and fully pooped out. Woohoo! Sorry for those on stream. Uh oh. Is there a lot of pixeling on stream, Teddy? Has anybody here watched the stream itself? I mean, it looks clear right now. So. Alright. Mandy here? Anybody here? Uh oh. Teddy? Uh oh. You didn't yeah. ask for me, but what's up? Oh, Steven's here. We'll take it. Damn. Specar. <laughs> Specar. Specar. Let's go. In the game three, Steven, who you got in this one? 5 p.m. or RB? RB took the last one, 5 p.m. took the first. Whose map pick is this technically? It's 5 p.m., dude. Right? 5 p.m. is gonna win it. They're feeling hot off the last map. They lost the last map. Yeah, they got destroyed off the last map. Oh shit! Not destroyed. And they didn't get destroyed. destroyed. Yeah, they had a they had a comeback trail. You know, honestly. Yeah, but they, they had a lot of two v fives and stuff, so they're feeling hot still. Like they lost because the first half. That I mean that like that link that link EGJS two v five with the Phoenix ult to bait them into swinging into Link's crossbar. That was insane. That was actually insane. That was so good. All right, here we go. Three. We are seeing 5 p.m. play attackers first, which is the first for this series. Here we go on Ascant, some would say. Only oh, you. Ascant. No, I'm pretty sure that's what Teddy says. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Only Teddy. <laughs> it's spreading. All right. A couple of changes might come in um, here. Look at me. Link back Robert on. AJ. East JS. On the back Viper. on Viper, Link right. back on Phoenix. They want to go with most comfortable for them on Breeze. And it worked first game. Fine sight on the KO. Mayan switching from the Chamber to KJ. KJ is so important on B on Ascent though. If you have a good KJ, B basically is shut down. Yeah, and can, I guess compared to the first game, Man just didn't get as much value on the chamber in game two, so maybe he feels like, hey, let's switch to a character that I know is good on Ascent. I can still play the Lurker role and make my impact known. Doesn't need to be chamber. On the other hand, Captain Ouija hovering the Omen right now. He might not play an entry fragger here. He played entry for them on the other two maps. He played Raze, he played a Yoru. But I think here, choose your agent. Zero duelist, and have. I mean, Weezy's probably gonna be entering for them anyway. But maybe they put him straight on the omen. It's gonna be a lock. So omen here with the viper to provide double smokes. The only smokes coming in from the side of high PM, all viper. Do you think that's sufficient on this map? I don't know. I'm asking the crowd, Steven. The analyst Steven, do you think it's sufficient to have just Viper have smokes for you on Ascent? Or do you think it, the better play was to do what uh, RB didn't have Omen? I mean, this is this map, like, I feel like Omen's better than Viper. Because uh, you can get mid control easier and then, you know, get the, use the third smoke. You know, like, wait it out, use the third smoke after getting info. Yeah. Like, if you just smoke, like, for example, you do mid, you get mid control, and then later on, you get the third smoke, you just smoke heaven on. Uh, on A, it's pretty free, so, gotcha. I don't know, I think you only need one, but Viper is not the best one for this. But Viper smokes do provide decay, so if they try to push through a smoke, they're pretty much fucked. Am I allowed to say that? Am I allowed to say the F word? Yeah, you can say the F word. Okay. I just told the stream I was taking a shit, so. I feel like the F word is higher yeah, on the naughty so. list. Probably less viscerally disgusting. <laughs> mm. All right. Or is an or permitting? Looks like an A tilt here. Easy JS with a bomb. In connector doesn't see anybody here. Jay Chung with a shorty in mid. We've seen him do this a lot. 
Get a free kill with the shorty, teleport out, switch to his pistol. I mean, now that they're looking back towards mid, it might happen again, honestly. Oh, he's gonna die. Doesn't spot him. Oh, they might think it's safe for them then. Uh oh. Oh, he's feeling it. I can see it in his eyes. There's no way he doesn't get this kill here. I have no idea. They're not gonna push it though. And he's not gonna swing at them. It's just gonna be a stalemate. I've just been stuck in his POV because I'm in suspense of what's going to happen, but it looks like nothing is going to happen. And they're gonna... he's already down to half yeah. HP. I mean, his position there got them so much info now because he hears left. the billion footsteps heading over towards B. But nobody's on B, and Weezy's going to try to spray through the smoke, get a lucky headshot. Doesn't actually hit any shots. And there's no chamber trap to slow them down from getting on the site. The door closed, he's going to break it. Now, man here. Ooh, sees Jay Chung. Gets pinged out by the recon. It's gonna be a crazy retake. Alura Zinia gonna push. Man! Man goes down to the shorty. Oh, they're gonna push him in on site. Everybody's on site here. One enemy remaining. Oh, Luigi with the 4K. 4K. I totally missed the stream. I didn't think it was gonna happen. That was so fast. <laughs> Wait, it was so fast. What the hell? Flawless. We didn't even say anything about Ouija until he got the 4K, and then you're like, wait, Ouija with the 4K! <laughs> Did you catch it at least? I didn't even catch it. Were you watching no. Ouija? Oh no, well... It happened. <laughs> Trust me. Oh no. Well, I mean, that's pretty big. Good start for RG. What a retake! Chung with the marshal here. Nobody's gonna kill them though. They're gonna slow them down in a main with a viper utility. Go spam through. Link just runs out. Much going, but there's still some Emmy. Is Emmy gonna be able to heal here? No. Oh, nice. Oh, but she cut off of that one. Emmy is sick with this. And now 3v3. Three, three. Oh no! Oh, she's happy. Jinx him. GD swings though and takes her down. That's pretty funny. And, ooh, nice right hit one. Can you get more? No, you can't. But I mean, that was pretty nice. Nice shots from Emmy. Kill two of them off and then may end with the last one. But and going as just pistols in. into that site, getting three of their eco buys. Yeah, I mean, Link died immediately, too. He went through, and they just, like, took him up. But even with that said, like, That's they followed him in, got a couple trade kills on Emmy. Pretty big round. But, unfortunately... I mean, actually, look, Defiant Slice is going to buy down. He has no money left. He can't really bonus this round, so... If they end up losing this round... Oh, wait, he's going to sell back up. That's not enough to bonus. Oh, okay, he's going to sell his judge and buy a fuck you. So the bonus is a little scuffed, but it's still a bonus. Except he's trying to peeking mid, mid, but he misses easy JS on the right side of mid. Oh, but he's still the shoulder. Oh, oh. He's still the shoulder. Ooh, his man. Oh, on the he does shot. remain. Enemy. Still the man already both happy to peek. This guy played like Car 98 quick scopes on Call of Duty. <laughs> <laughs> They just do very little damage to him. Bring him down to 5090 feet. Nice flash from the side. Oh, just the goes down. And then Javier here in heaven. Not even going to play with it. They're going to wait for his team. Now that his team is grouped up, it's his chance. Where is he going to check Cat? Spike planted. Does EJS have the post play of toxins though, like Gunner does? Javier trying to swing out, can't see anybody. Oh, the Easy just oh, like push oh, all the way around the cap. Oh, Javier still hoping well, to get them off guard. Eddie, the KJ stops the plane. He doesn't know Javier's up here. Last player standing. Easy JS gets a free kill, and now it's just Javier oh. Kevin. Oh. Tries to spray down the end, brings him down. very low. Not low enough. 
got nine, what, eight extra HP. And they the take the first HP. rifle round. They did take lots of damage, though, so they can't completely buy back into this. Easy JS can drop Sopa. But then Emmy won't have a full buy, so. Are we gonna see Easy JS drop Emmy here? Yeah. There we go. Maybe so far, the Spectre, they've done this before. Last game, too. Gets tagged by the recon. J Chung here watching Connector, not watching Cat necessarily. He might not know the man has moved so far up Cat. Oh, An insight playing this close. Right side angle. He might get a few picks here. He gets one, but then gets taken down by man. Man on Cat kills two. Both Just J Chung and Niji. Yeah, both of them up in heaven. Sopa might spot them with this drone he's about to send out. Doesn't send out the drone. Going out. For something with his old or, or with his his one is heaven. We Captain, we need to drop some to say, take some down. Jay Chong checking his health, oh, gets sure. one. Just tap the bomb. One enemy remains. Jay Chong yeah. winning every fight. Oh. Uh... Flush round from <laughs> EG and Jay Chong. This They're gonna donate nice, the over the old charge to Jay Chong. Young on the they didn't actually sink. So. Get one orb away from all, and usually A main is a and B main. These are both really orb easy orbs to grab, as long as the other team is not there. Out of charges. That works. They don't have the healthiest buy though. They're over on RB. JJ's not even gonna drop one, so they can get full armor. Shadows. And 5 p.m. almost in a full save. Viper wall goes down. Ouija with a solo hold on site. He's gonna actually drop behind the smoke wall and wait for his team. It's gonna be a. And the ease that they're getting onto B site with, that wouldn't happen if they had a KJ. And the other team does. So, we're not going to see these kinds of B takes. Those on site are all bunched there, only the Omen TP's in, gets as much intel as he can. Kills are flying through. It's just too hard to hold with their weaponry. Last player gets one, so that's it. That's the only kill they can get. They do get the bomb plant down though, which is good for their money situation. Toxins going up. Toxin screen down. This is the first half of Valorant we've seen for these two teams, with a defensive side actually yeah. working out pretty well. I mean, that could be the X factor. If they can win on defense and maintain what they did on offense the last couple games, like... But I think we're going to see just as strong of a defense side. Yeah, with the KJ. From 5 p.m. Yeah, with the KJ. The Viper plays on A, KJ plays on B. Hopeless mice. They also lost duelists for Here. this. Here. Yeah. Five p.m. set up outside of A. They know at least one is there because they take down the Sova dart. Link pushes up with this spike. He sh definitely should not be first one in with this spike. Spot inside, but inside takes a lot of HP from him. He might be able to ult into here. Wait, man, this time she's ready for him. He's in the smoke, but. Poison's Link just drops. barely avoids yeah. that dart. When this smoke drops, one of man is well, going down, and it's gonna be man that goes down. Now is Link gonna hold into this? Hope to get the bomb down. The three of their uh, oh, yeah, they know yeah, Link is there. Jonah's out. Right here. But Link manages to make it out of there. 
they're going to hear them rotating here. So is anyone there to meet them mid? They're not even going to go mid. They're going to go full seconds left. rotate through their spawn. Poison's off. Jay Chung here at the corner posted up with the off though. He's ready for this. I mean, he hears them. This is a certified This is his oh, pick though. Doesn't TP out either, but gets the pick on Sopa, then TP's out. They have 10 seconds, seconds to plant this bomb. And they just Five kill Link with the bomb. And there is now no time. And... One enemy oh, remaining. Cool. Yeah, Easy Dance uses his ult there. If Link would have made it onto site, it would have been a pretty important round. They could have gotten it, but... Link drops the bomb before he makes them to site. A gift. That round hurts. That info in the rotate. Yeah, Lurzini, I heard everything going on there. It's critical <laughs> that she killed Mayan. Yeah, and also, freed up normally mid winning those and lurking. I mean, I do think that's a pretty critical part of beating 5pm. If they can cut out the lurks from Mayan and you can and actually up. have that space in mid. Yep. They can collect info and Ouija just sprang through smoke and killing off Emmy. EasyJS is playing as well, is really smart. He's waiting until his team makes it almost all the way ready to bust out of B main and then is throwing up his wall. So they don't even expect it coming. Ouija's gonna go hunt the KJ all down. And they do. Too easy for them. And now it's just gonna be EasyJS. Freddy's on site. Let's see if they can hold against the four person onslaught. Poison off. Last player standing. Nice kill. He's gonna go through the poison field and get around the wall. But he's gonna have he to doesn't have time. He's gonna take the nade to get through. One enemy oh! remaining. Oh! So oh my oh, gosh! Yes, yeah, this is so clutch! He's gotta have it! Clutch. Oh! But boy, oh two! Wow! That was so clutch! What a clutch. kill from oh Jeff. Through the box, gets the diffuser what with the heck? so little time. Wow. Through, they thought they had that, but the they, spray I the thought box. they had it. Yeah. Jumping through the KO nade, taking basically all of his HP, and then spraying through the box, getting a 2k there. That oh, was insane. Annoying. Someone tell Jeff well, to go through the lottery ticket. <laughs> There's no luck involved there. That man did everything intentionally. He the odds were st stacked against him, though. <laughs> he overcame them. He just threw wow. pure force of will. What a great end of the round. That was insane. I mean, I hope that's the shot in the arm they need. Yeah, agreed. This team oh, is J Chan going to push this wall mid with his. Oh, man. They're Five of them on cat. J Chan has no idea. Oh, no. Luigi didn't see they that. Know now. Will J Chan take a blind shot? Just misses Jeff's. Oh, Defiant Sight gets one against Tradius. Oh, huge round for Lerzinia! Three! Spike down oh. A. What a, what a angle she had there. Emmy can do this though, but if Jay Chung swings Blank. fast, could've got her. He know, she knows that one is in heaven. Javier trying to bounce some darts into hell. You know where Jay Chung is though. He's gonna play this one slow, but Jay Chung's gonna shoot her in the oh, back here. Back to Jay Chung and he takes her out. She was hoping that the one that would peak first was heaven. So she could get a It's a replay on Allura here. No fucking yeah, breath, breath. What an angle. Check your corners, friends. Jay Chung 9k going into this Ew. round. He can drop all the guns. Luigi's 14 and 4. And we're just not seeing Emmy, EasyJS, or Mayan be the top fraggers that we're used to seeing in either of these That's games yet. Point. They pulled it off first game, but... In we go. It's gonna be a slow round. No one peeking anybody just yet. 
Javi is about to send some shock darts through. Might get some damage. Doesn't look like it's going to be case, but he has an Odin. I hope they're ready for this because if he ever... He's ready, but does send it up earlier. He does do some damage to me, and who sticks the orb, even though the Odin was running. That takes some cold right there. Javi, no! Javi takes out the orb! No way! Javi <laughs> with the Javi. Odin! He just held the button what down. What a beast. He held it down. We've seen lots of Odin play this tournament. And it's oh, always worked out for the them. Odin. We've seen some big plays from Odin's. The Nick Mead was playing Odin. Oh, there's no way that just happened. <laughs> I mean, they gotta be in a bad, like, mental spot right now. They know that they're strong as attackers, and they're just not pulling it off this half. Where's that timeout? That's the other yeah, they need the do. they need the powerful timeout. <laughs> Curtis oh, he Teddy. Misses. That was big. That could be the opening they need. Link is gonna streak down Cat. Slow down though by Allura. And he still has his ult. He can really push in and get some intel. Maybe do some damage. Yeah. He's been holding he... on to this ult for a while. He's gonna start investing it over to the B site though. It looks like they're tilting that direction. With every defender except for Javier with the Odin. I'm in mean, the swing on him here with the Odin. That's all though. you need though. I'm a little afraid. Oh, Javi. Oh, Javi. no. If three of them swing into oh, this no. again, this feeling. is trouble. Javi. Javi. Oh, Link takes mind. him okay. down, okay. saving probably three of their yeah. lives at least. Javi overheated a little bit. Oh, no. <laughs> now, is Link going to push into this with his ult? They think somebody might be on site, but it doesn't look like there is. So they're just going to get the no plan down. Left. Take the 5v3. Going up. Every member of RV coming through their own spawn. Man, there's at least one is there. Oh, Ouija. Oh, Emmy gets Erased a beautiful one. Erased by Emmy. Emmy. Oh, look at me, and too. A lurker like always. Just waiting for footsteps. Looks like they might not try to take this round. Yeah. Looks like they're gonna save. Man might hunt them. I take back a, a gun or so. Oh, they have nice a pretty stuff. healthy economy, though. I mean, they couldn't win it, but they could oh, do a lot more damage than they're doing here. Man did steal Jay Chung's off from mid, though. So Sopa does go down yeah, all on his own. That's a little awkward. <laughs> <laughs> he just really wanted to make sure that bomb did not get diffused. Luckily, he can still get a buy. Full buys from both teams. I'd like to see at least a 4-8 here. Link finally has ult here. He's finally has ult. ult. Finally yeah, is going to ult. Yeah. Knows where <laughs> Omen is, maybe. Um, but Omen TP's out of site. that spot. He, in boat Link's anything. able to clear the site, though. They know site is clear. They can push onto it freely now. Link and it go back into the smoke. Oh, hey, Chon! A blind oh, oh shot of Emmy! EasyJS does have his ult here, though. And we see Mayan's ult, too. He puts the KJ ult in a spot number. that's really awkward to swing. Because we have to turn that direction to kill the KJ ult. The zero player is detained, but lots of time bought. 3v3 here. Chong looking for a pick. Oh, Javi is gonna push right into that toxin, take a ton of damage, and get taken down. Oh no! Toxin knows where. Oh, oh god! EasyJS is too free. Beautiful. But that was a beautiful hit. round out he of five man. Man. He's back online. And they they did use two of their ults the there though, so they're only down to Sopa's ult, which is really important post plant. So if they can get a, another plant down, they might be able to secure this last round. What looked like a pretty abysmal attacking side, though, for 5 p.m. has turned into something that's not bad. 7-4. If they make this 7-5, that's a pretty they competitive attack. Yeah. Against a team... It's gonna be hard, yeah. Yeah, against a team I'm that has no duelists. That team with right. no duelists 
might have a hard time actually accessing their sights on attack, so. Javi's arrow just spots Link. Enemy mark. But EasyJS puts up his wall, so they know he's probably gonna push in. Javi's gonna ult. And Viper is able to do a lot of damage with that toxin. Now, Sopa under heaven. This is not where I'd want to be with my ult. I'd try to get back to main. He isn't able to. One enemy remaining. Man and man. Now, Mayan's not going to throw off the ult, and I don't blame her. It would give. Or no, oh, not Mayan. Nice oh. Alora didn't use her ult there, which would have really the been worked against save them. The Switching sides. <laughs> Wait, did anybody see the Javier shot guard? Mm -mm, what happened? Did you see it on my screen? No. <laughs> I don't know. He he spent all this time lining it up. He shot it and bounced it straight into the air off the map. He spent so much time lining it up on this box. He <laughs> just shot it into Narnia. It's fine. It's fine. They won the round. All right, we're switching sides yeah. here. Man, over on A. This is not what I expected. And this is not where I think KJ is strongest. Let's see I mean, see nobody's how it works, on B. But... They're just taking the gamble here. And it's, that, it might, it pay, might off. pay off. <laughs> yeah, look at everybody stacked around A. Look at them push down mid with the smoke line to give them cover from B. Oh, <laughs> no. Man misses his need to hold them off. So they just take fight without any damage. Man, was in big trouble there. Emmy trying that to get them back. That was an important back. need to miss. Oh, Spike Emmy planted. can't get the big trouble. Can't get defiant sight. Nice trade from Sopa. Sopa, oh, calm down, Sopa. Oh no. Can I get this flank? Oh, Last yeah. player standing. It's one. It's pretty low. It might be doable. Oh. He'll go it's down. It's two. Nine four. And if Mayhem would have hit that nade, blocked them off on a main, it would have been a lot closer. That had to hurt. Easy JS giving us a J Chung play here. <laughs> Captain Miji gonna fool buy yeah. into this. The problem with the Easy JS version of it is he can't teleport out to safety willy nilly. Right. And he's not playing as close. Oh, J Chung already opening up that round on <laughs> Sopa. Oh no, man in heaven. He's living a life of fear. He's living a life of full fear. He's gonna get blinded. Bomb grenade out. Alright. Door closed. Spike planted. Oh, take time again. The enemy goes down. Can deep. Shock darts. Doing a little bit of shit. Yes, on a long rotate. You're gonna and peek me. into a closed yeah, door. There's Xenia with the specter though. Oh, oh and Weezy sprays him through oh, the smoke. Oh, damn. This isn't looking good. We're gonna see our first rifle buy out of 5 p.m., but if they don't get this, it might be game. Yeah, definitely. Man can't even pull by a rifle either. I'd sell back my armor and go full rifle, half shields here. But again, that's why I'm not in the finals, so. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna need some juice from the fraggers this round to come online into this game. They are going up against primarily a bonus round, so. But this bonus round, even though it's primarily one, it's just two rifles. Down. Yeah. It's a pretty strong bonus. Boys and orb and not really a bonus for those guys, actually, or at least in Chung. But... Slow down the advance. On Is that going to be enough utility to scare them away from B? Look on Cat. Link on Cat. I try to find one. Can't see anybody. 
But they're going to rotate back towards his direction. If he mistimes this, he might go down. He has to be careful. Hold the angle, Link. Oh, he sees the shoulder. Oh, get swung by four of them. They're not going to continue to swing him. And then there's... Oh, no! Oh, no. The name takes Oh, but easy to ask. It's done. Alright, this is these are the picks they needed. Link did go down, but they got two of them. Yep. The bomb is stayed They're over going here into Javier. a site. Javier gets reconned and caught by the recon. But he's gonna run cat I mean they know he's cat. He's surely going down here. He's dead. Last player standing. Thirty now seconds left. Spike down. Ouija can do it. I mean Ouija's a fragger. Yeah. Doesn't have feet. HP on his side, but Cover going out. He can ult right onto that bomb. Set himself up inside a B, all onto the bomb. It doesn't have enough time. Ten he seconds do left. While standing on top of A. Spike. He's stolen it away. Spike planted. Teleports into hell. They think he's B. Oh no. Traveling. Oh, oh no. geez. Disaster. Oh no. Turn. Turn. Oh, no. And Easy JS was fooled by, it, and now he has to run back towards A. Easy JS does have an ult here, though. They've got to find him, though. Do they know he might be hell here? He hears them. Listen he knows exactly the where they are. Sopa is going to drop down and get traded. Oh, standing. no. And it's going to be Sopa for Luigi. Luigi wins uh, it. Oh, he shit. He off 22 <laughs> HP and the 4K. Oh, he's going to be running on this high. Oh, no. But yeah, this is disastrous for 5 p.m. Yeah. They have no buy into this. Going up against full rifles, a pretty healthy economy. Here. Here. This just wasn't their map. It looks like a little bit of a comeback was happening in the first half, but now. I think we might see an early ult from EasyJS here. Yeah. They've lost three rounds in a row on this. Uh, well, I guess their defense, the defending side. Ouija gonna swing here. Gonna see if he can see anybody in the corner. Sees nobody. Already somebody goes down. Jaechung goes down though. Let's see if Javier. If these two get a little too antsy, Javier might get a kill. Oh no! Allura takes out Link. Oh Here no, Javi waiting though. Javi goes down. One enemy Ooh, remaining. Good plays. Emmy's still alive up here in heaven. Sense. With pistol in hand. Oh, and Allura isn't able to kill that blind, but oh. still, I mean, he doesn't get the kill on her. She's gonna close she's the door. I know where he is. Oh, wow, she's gonna she use her feet, but she Don't stays alive. Down. 11 HP. She's gonna stick. Okay. Hits off in the last second, and Sopa goes in. That was a real important round. If they didn't win that one. Jay Chung can't quite buy into this, but if he can grab an orb, which is pretty easy for him to do. Yeah, I'm sure the whole team is going to play around yeah. it. Everybody on RB's got the 4K, is that right? Have they? Oh, no. At least. I In think. sight. Jay Chung, not yet. Easy guys ready to pull off his ult, but doesn't hear anyone, so hold it back. All five of them in top mid right here. Allure and Javi waiting for the push from A main, but Easy JS is just gonna hold. Pushing into him though. Oh, Link totally blind. What an Link is down to BG. Easy JS, we might see him put off his ult now. Oh, he sees the omen t TP come oh, in. His gun is oh, oh, God. Wow, the timing. Oh. oh, he gets swung from two sides though. Too difficult to play that for him. Oh, oh Emmy gets Emmy the. Clean. Come on, Emmy. One enemy remaining. Emmy. Oh, oh. So clean. what a beautiful round, Emmy. Wow. Man, he's gonna take the old sack, Emmy. He didn't even the best ult to win that round. Turret out. And they broke the economy over on yeah, RB. A beating pulse over there on 5 p.m. Oh, God. RB. Uh, economy isn't feeling so hot. No.
Have to buy Sopa with almost 9k, so... They don't want to lose this, but if they do, they can still buy into next, which is important if they want to go for a tie. No prisoners. We're seeing a mid split here. J Chang gonna peek they with his ult. Play, let's play. Oh, and <laughs> Easy Chance does some damage to him. Takes away some shield and HP. Here and all ult. five of them pushing into mid. Feinstein has ult ready. If they push Emmy's mid, watching it though, space. and I don't want to come against Emmy. Oh, is Emmy. Emmy thinks one, one two, two. She gets out, out of one. there. Flashes, peeks again, oh, takes another. She's insane. She's takes her fourth, and they get the round. Beautiful round, two in a row from Emmy. She is holding this team together. She didn't take a Taking them to worlds. Oh, that was nuts. She just tore them in half. The J-Chunk invested his ult there, too. Pretty unfortunate for them. Yeah, they and able to didn't, it didn't pay off for him. He has an op this round, at least. Even if he doesn't have full armor, so... Can still get a pick. But not as easy as when he had the ult running. Oh, easy to have knows they're outside of A, and he ults them off. They're not gonna push into this, are they? No, they're gonna back Hey, Ao can't take that ult down. No one wants to fight easy JS in that. They're gonna sprint away from it. I don't think so they heard the smoke get out though. Mid. He peeks mid into five people. Oh no, disaster from Sopa. And Hey, but we do out. have Mayan set up over on B, so if they try to push this alley, he's gonna take them down. Long grenade out. He's gonna pop the nade, kill off the fire uh, site. Oh, uh, he's still in the nade, ouch! But he's okay, 4v4. They make it on the site. Allura's gonna get this bomb down. Luigi's positioning though, he could catch Allura off guard if she's not- or not Allura, Emmy off guard if she's not careful. They will come. Oh, Emmy ults. Emmy sees him. Oh, he's gonna run away. He's his head! It's just a duel, oh, no. a duel of fates. He's gonna teleport to the backside away. He doesn't want that smoke. And he goes down to Jay Big round. Jay Chung teleports away too. And now from main. I don't know if they know. They One don't know. Remaining. Oh, but they win the round. 5 p.m.'s gotta crawl to keep themselves in All this. Right. Match, Match point. point. Series point. Playing for the OT. Championship point. <laughs> Play for the OT. <laughs> it's Let's the see a 28 point. An OT. Let's see if we can get another 38 round game out of this competition. We're going till tomorrow. The, the bright side <laughs> is that everybody gets a gun in this round of fates. Let's see if they can make it count on 5 p.m. Give them a couple more rounds of life. Jay Chung gonna peek mid. Is Lang gonna use his ult here to get some intel? Oh, we see an early ult out of Sopa. Not gonna get Jay Chung though. Easy to ask, keep it off cat. Well, if he pushes this fast enough, he'll be able to get Sova. Gonna kill Link as well. Gonna kill Mayan as well as Ouija's turn oh, to clinch it. Can't kill oh. Emmy though. The reload saved Emmy's life. And they've got to know he has his life in Mayan. He set off Chamber's so trip. Oh, yeah, so but Easy Jazz gets two easy more. picks. Not more. looking towards him, but then looks away, and Luigi takes him out. They know one is under heaven, though. Last player standing. Sopa. Emmy versus Luigi. Who can oh. win it? And Luigi's at low HP. Oh, oh she clutches oh. yet another round. Keeps 5 p.m. alive. So if anyone can do it, Emmy can do it. Emmy's holding it all. Yeah, she's holding it together. She's a glue that keeps 5 p.m. A rickety ship, but still afloat. It's the teen energy we all need. <laughs> I mean, the economy, though, kind of kind of broken. It's going to be a weird half-buy here for uh, RB, as Defiant Insight and Jay Chung don't really have enough money, and Jay Chung's too far away from an ult, so they're going to opt to save instead. 
sack this next round potentially and fight for a match point at 12-9. But who knows? No ults on behalf of 5 p.m. though. No ults across the board. Oh, Ouija, oh no. Link, it's a really important entry pick. I don't know if I've ever seen Link up before, <laughs> but it worked. It worked. Allura is that. one away from an ult, though. Jay if they Chung. let her plant the bomb, this could be an easy round for them. Chung, they just have to make it on the site. Sprinting on the site. Emmy in this corner, though. Oh my oh, gosh, she takes one. one. Oh, she gets a win. Gets out of there. Two. Gets another. Gets out of there again. Oh, oh but Insight takes her down, the but she does lots of damage. Down. Allure only has 14 HP. Do they know man's here? One no. enemy remaining. <laughs> the easiest Allure does down. get a pick hey. though, even with only 14 HP. They know where she is. Man swings and takes her down. All right. Keeping the dream alive. Another Maybe the momentum round. is back on their side. Another critical round at 12-10. Buys out from both teams. This could be the one. If they lose this round, though, I mean, obviously, if IPM loses this round, it's all over. And RB they're set up to go B, and unfortunately, Mayan's over on yeah. A. And has the ult, so that's a real bummer. Had she heard them push into B, she could easily fend them off. If RB lose this round, though, their economy is going to be busted again. They'll probably have to take it to 12-11. Let's see if they can win this one out and close out the championship. He's just playing this alley. Poison's off. Oh, oh, and the Sova drone doesn't oh. see him. Nice pick from Link. Poison off. Kind of not off often, but when he does, it always works. By inside, trying to place it off again. He's so slippery, though. Spike they finally down, get him, but B. not after getting traded by Emmy. And now, all three of them on site though, and they have to push into oh. some smokes. And they're stuck. Emmy. Oh, but bombs down on this alley. That's so awkward for them. They got the. Oh, and man's gonna ult. Oh no! They're all gonna be detained. They're just running away. They're teasing. They can't. Wait, Ouija. One enemy remaining. They what a beautiful it. round. Emmy has now, just been oh my gosh. the last couple of rounds. 26 and 17 now. She couldn't have done that without May in that round, yeah, though. Really that ult was ult. clutch. Oh, and we're seeing Javi take the timeout. Yeah, they're going to try to ice them here near the finish line. It's not a full buy from RB, though. Their economy is scuffed yet again. Maybe it's a thrifty to end it all, but if not, goes down to 12-11 and then one pivotal round to determine overtime or championship. What's the adjustment here? Is there any adjustment that the attackers need to make? I mean, like, RB has really been stalled. The last seven rounds, they've lost six of them. What would you yeah, do? Yeah, and <laughs> Mayan keeps switching the sights, so they can't even predict how to avoid KJ. What was that? What would you do, Teddy? 12, what would you switch up? You no I mean... If you're the attackers, how do you play this? You, they've lost... Six out of the last seven rounds. Play the uh, play for the ult. I think they do. Can you do target it. Emmy or do you avoid Emmy? I think they eco this round and then see what shifty stuff they can pull off. The they can play for the ult orb on Jay Chung and get a free gun that way. But I mean, it looks like and that's pretty that. or easy orb to grab. Oh, oh wait, they're selling grenade. guns now. They're a little Placing disparate on their economy. Right yeah, well, they want to go into safe. the last round with a full buy, right? If they yeah. buy into this and give it up, then they don't have a buy next. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be a full save. Hey, but they might have a chance. You've yeah. seen it before. Right. They do get Jay Chung the you orb. Want to play? Let's play. Ults right away. Oh, there's no ult. Okay. They know he's primarily set up over on A, though, so they might already be rotating over towards A. And Easy JS is going to flank, but. Uh, Chamber usually has a strip wire set up, so they're gonna know. They all know now, but they're, they're waiting. Oh, Man, my critical kills. One enemy, enemy remaining. Wow. What a sweet, yeah. a 
flawless this. round. To 12, 11. This could be. All right, we might be seeing another, OT. Another championship point. This is it. This is it. <laughs> Guns out for everyone. Where are we going? You close it out of here or go into overtime. And actually, it's not a full buy from the RB side. Oh, they have to sell util for this gun. He's trying to sell enough util. He's going to actually sell his Elf? shields and go to light shields. shields. Yeah. Oh, wait, he's gonna buy full shields. He does he's have gonna get Bob, a drop though. From somebody else and then and buy he has an oil bulldog. So, so even if they him. lose Bomb. We'll see if it makes a difference to defy insights on a bulldog instead of a full vandal. Look at all the KJ ult outside A, though. If they go fast, they go fast into all the KJ util. It looks like it might be the fast play. It's the fast play. Found them. Kale oh, ults but in, but KJ mind. is far enough away. EGJS. Oh, can't kill Javier! He's gonna go down! That could be the pick Spike that needs planted. everything! They're all very injured, but they're all very alive! They're all playing inside of the ult, too. Luigi is gonna ult into A main. Oh. Uh, critical round for them here. This is a, a shitty retake for them. Oh, but they're doing it. Oh. Oh. Any going crazy in the smoke. Okay. Okay. Take, Take down the ult. Ten man pull this off. One v one. Oh, is behind him. Oh no. Oh no, he's got to get him. I died right now. So funny. Oh, Doesn't have the time. Oh, oh, it is. Oh. Everybody in the dirt. That was so close. Oh, uh, man, almost pulled off. Can't ask for a final much better than that. Can't no, ask you the can't. When it, clutching it out at the very end, Defiance Sight like buying just enough time for the bomb to go off. GG, Captain Ouija leading the way, but Emmy not far behind. I'm right she behind really him. really woke up in the second half. She did. But just not enough. RV carries it out to the very end. And look at all those first bloods right across the board for RB. Wow. Do we do we do an interview well, like we usually do with the league ones? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, let's do it. I, he was me nine. In to interview. Nine of my, in interview. He was Check nine of my seventeen deaths. Send me an interview. I'll be in the Of Ouija. What's it called? All right, we take an interview. <laughs> who are you taking? Who's, who are you taking? I don't know. Oh, I told them to send me an interview. Let's see who they see who they sent. Emmy on her debut. All right, who they yep. sent? They sent Captain Ouija. Captain Ouija. No, any easy JS. Yeah. All right, Teddy, Teddy yeah. interviewer Teddy. What are the questions you have for Captain Ouija? Cruising to his first championship. I'd say cruising, but this I mean, was pretty close. I don't know if it was a cruise, but yeah, I don't know about <laughs> calling it a cruise. Let's talk about ten two. How do you feel about that number? <laughs> I think that number is a wonderful number in most circumstances. Just uh, <laughs> not on Sundays. Not on Sundays. <laughs> no. Then two is closed on Sundays. All right. Yeah. So what changed? I mean, what 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 do you think brought it brought you guys back from that ten two like sweep on the like you obviously were having a lot of trouble on the uh, defender side, but you flipped that around for the second and third games. Yeah, so game? after the, the first game, we kind of talked about it, and we realized that their attack was so much more coordinated than our defense, and that if we wanted to win this, we would actually have to like play together and pick off each other and stuff. And so mm -hmm. we kind of just had to hammer that into each other's heads and like remind each other constantly throughout the game that not to get over-aggressive, make sure that we're, we're playing fundamentals right and stuff. Good, good. Also notice that you're the only uh, team to use the timeouts. Were those some crucial timeouts? Do you think they were helpful or? Yeah, that's credit goes to Javi on that one. Uh, I didn't even know that we could timeouts, but he's like, let's call a timeout. And I was like, all right, that's a great idea. <laughs> and those timeouts, we got the, kind of like what I said earlier, where we kind of just hammered in our heads that we're playing too aggressive or we're taking too many solo fights against these people that are just going to run at us and like mow us down one by one if we don't group up together. Very nice. Well, that's all I got. I don't play that as well hey, about hey, it. <laughs> Someone you. else ask some questions. <laughs> ask some what do you think made Ascent such an attack-sided map? We saw mostly 
really great defense play across the board on most maps, but Ascent, we kind of swapped it up there. Uh, I think for Ascent, it's just that normally we play a different team comp on Ascent, but we realized that we need to pull something off different here, so we went with double controller and that kind of let us be more flexible with how we're playing defense and offense, and kind of just let us, like, basically, like, even if one of us or two of us got picked off, we would still have an ability to, like, come back to the round. I mean, it really showed the duel, not having a duelist on the attack was a little tougher than your other two games. Yeah, definitely. But I think we were, we were like pretty warmed up by that point, and so we were all comfortable in taking our aim duels and making sure we were just trying to use our utility right to get our advantage. How did it feel having two captains on the same team? Was there like a conflict <laughs> of interest here, or like a struggle for power? Did one captain have to like eat the other captain if like they got yeah. too restrained? So you know, of course we butt heads because we're we're both captains. We both have that that like power. But at uh, at some point, Javi just looked at me and pulled out his shock darts and said, "Look at me, I am the captain <laughs> now," and I agreed. So, do you think that's because Javi that. has the capital C and you don't? Oh, yeah, he's got the he's capital C captain. I'm. Cool. I'm a lowercase and captain. He is the one that pulled out the timeouts. <laughs> it seems like he was the beating heart. Truly, he was the the beating heart behind all of our all of our plays. And what do you have to say about Emmy's breakout role? Honestly, I don't know where this came from. I remember uh, we were going into finals and we're like, oh, we're playing against 5 p.m. again. And I'm like, I think I remember that team. I don't remember them doing particularly fantastic against us. And. I was honestly surprised, but congrats to Emmy. That was really well played. There was a lot of really scary plays that she made. Had me concerned. <laughs> All right, well, thanks to the interview. Congrats on the win, and everybody. Major thanks yeah, to nice. our host, Brian, oh, that's me. for yeah, all Brian. he does oh. to make these possible. Thanks for the nice final. Lots of close games. So that's cool. <laughs> we wanted All to right. make it interesting. Like and subscribe. Yeah, like and subscribe. <laughs> Goodbye, yeah. stream. See you guys Follow next both time. channels, What's please. Next? I don't even know what's next. I don't think the league one is next. It's going to be a long time till we do the league tournament. I think literally in January or something. So maybe we'll do a TFT one here or there. Who knows? All right. Thanks, everyone. Goodbye and good night. Bye.